Hey, YouTube Boyd, you didn't miss anything. It's good to be back on Chrono Trigger. Alrighty. A little late tonight, but let's let's just jump right into it. You coward. Oh, man. Okay, so we left off right here. We have Marley's side quest to do. And I already know it involves the rainbow shell. Which is something in cross, so this has a little bit of setting lore to it. Alright, so, well, uh, I guess I gotta bring up the... Yeah, Tito outline. <gasps> okay. All right, so you start out in 600. Cool. All righty, but it's, it's great to see you guys. Hopefully you had a good couple days in the week so far. You're busting out them jobs, earning that paper. What's, I'm really curious, what's the rhythm game? Man, there needs to be more lewd, etchy anime rhythm games, not just the cooking. I mean, like, actual, like, actual nudity. I mean, I know Senra Kaga actually does have actual nudity, but... They, they sometimes skimp a little on it. No, he would just outright tell me if it was Senran Kaga Bon Appetit. He already knows about that game. Alright, here we go. Get off, yeah. That's what I'm gonna do later tonight after I'm done with this stream. I was waiting to make that joke ever since I had this goddamn flying machine. Yes, it is, and you are old, Matt. Oh, it is? Oh, why'd you just come out and say he was Bon Appetit? I thought you already knew about that game. Oh, why? <laughs> why the centrifuge? <laughs> what do you mean I'm old? <laughs> I ain't old. <laughs> oh yeah, hey Robo. I'm or other Robo. Wait, what? We cause a time paradox. Hey, other Robo. I mean, I just didn't guess Bon Appetit because you would just say you wouldn't you wouldn't just keep calling it that rhythm game or not giving out its name unless you really wanted me to guess because my first guess would have been Bon Appetit. I just I just thought you would just got straight to the point. <laughs> oh my god, I have to go to fucking um fucking um what's this goddamn place? Oh, chorus again. I don't even know where that fucking place is. I don't even remember. Well, sure, I want to stream Bon Appetit one day too. You're just beating me to it. Cool. No, that's poor. That's poor, eh? That's actually very important. That proper name is very important. Uh, where was Chorus? Like, around on one of these islands? Yeah, it was down there. And, but anyway. Hey. Yeah, here we go. Uh, ba da ba. An island? Oh, no, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, I just have to go to the the, the the ruins again? Oh boy, I already can't read. Oh no, I I have to go to the bar. This this guy this guy has written like this Nintendo hotline is fucking shit. I can't decide what information to give me yet good moments in the pe fucking paragraph. Ah, well met, Chrono. I finally stumbled upon a hint I was worried about the rainbow shell. I still can't shake the feeling that things will go sour this time. I fear my luck had finally run out. Say, would you mind holding on to this for me? Oh, yes, your alcohol, your spirits. Boy, what the fuck was this censored to in 1995? I can only imagine. It was like coffee. Hold, hold, hold on to this, uh, coffee for me. Now, I'm really curious. Oh, it was soda! It was soda! The guide mentions it right here. I'm sorry, the Nintendo Hotline mentions it right here. It was- it was soda. <laughs> oh, young censorship. Yeah, people say the fucking- well, no, the DS version used the upgraded script. Yeah, and Super Nintendo version sucks. This game sucks on SNES. How'd this game ever pop off? Head forwards in the western part of the island. Oh, that's his grave! I was wondering what that gravestone was. That makes a lot more sense. <laughs> 
Here lies the great explorer, explorer Tova, Toma Levine. I can't read. Oh no, he's dead. And Chrono does pour the soda on the grave. Oh no, it's been many a day. I located the rainbow shell as it were. To the northwest of this cape is a large island called the Giant's Claw. The shell is there. Well, thank you. But beware, there are droves of monsters afoot there. Well then, I believe this is farewell. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> Ah, there's truly no drink as fun as the one shared in the company of friends. Oh, yeah. Chrono's not old enough to drink. Well, I don't know. Maybe by the laws, well, like, not even... Well, who knows? Ooh, a sped capsule. zip right up here. I guess we'll save if it's this island so scary. This looks like an FF this looks like the cave from FF4. Crumpled note written Thomas in these holes perhaps they are not meant to be they are meant to be jumped in. Okay. Oh yo whoa 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 also wait this is the copied throne room from the dino fort Or, actually, oh, okay, they acknowledge it. Okay. It, they acknowledge it. Never mind. This is like when I thought they reused Amy's voice actress for the next side character in the scene after she appeared. But but I but I got shown up in that game, too. This place must have been pushed far underground when lava was fell into the earth. Oh, that's the reason. I guess that makes sense. I, I guess. Oh, lord. Oh, wait, dinos again. I can whip out my electricity. My electricity. Oh, I don't want to attack that one. You're fine. Good crit, good crit. Nice, Marley. Shield sphere, yup. They dropped decent XP for being the old enemies. The clarity cap. <laughs> the cap of clarity. Oh. Okay. Oh, that's one defense, though, but I kind of like the having shadow damage. Maybe I'll give it to someone else. Yeah, there we go. You, that, you get three off of that. Well, I guess I'll give it to you. Clarity cap is poo-poo. Uh, I was going to say, there has to be a little more to this place. Well, there is. Okay. Oh, I guess so. God, I hate these guys. Chrono, fuck this guy. Thank you. Good crit, Marley! Marley Marley's bringing her A-game. Alrighty. Not bad. We're, we're leveling up. We do be leveling up a little. I'm wondering what level the game expects you to fight Lavos at. 
When was the last time you used a chrono spin move? It's been a dumb... I definitely used it last stream session against one of the... Yeah, okay. Oh, uh, this is a real one, right? I, I, well, I don't know if it was in my, I don't know if it was in the fight where I succeeded, but I used one last time when the computer was giving me trouble. Mother brain. Oh, did I just kill a cat? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Hello? Uh, I don't know why that we. Okay, I know, I'm sorry. I had no idea that's what that button would do. What's a cat doing here? Oh, God. Okay, fine. Actually, to be honest, these enemies are pretty fucking easy for the EXP they drop off. Oh, is that good old Bubs? It's great to see you. Are we doing more Papper Mario? Uh, Vespi, can you give Bubs a nice shout out? Please and thank yous. <laughs> no, it's good to see you, homie. And you were doing Papper Mario. Nice. You've been doing that game every so often, you must be almost done with it, if I had to guess. But hey, y'all. Hey, y'all. Matt here. I am also at the tail end of my game. While I can't do all the bonus content tonight, I do think I'm going to fight the final boss of this game tonight. All right, let's do that. If everything goes well, at the very least, I did start slightly late, but we'll just we'll just nay nay on the we'll just win we'll just beat the game, forehead. Okay, let's go back in time. No, 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 no! I just, I just, I just said, I just said, no, it's great seeing you. You, I, I said you must almost be done with Paper Mario if I had to guess. Although I, although I should catch up on your VODs, to be honest. This would be nice. You're probably almost done with Paper Mario. I'm at the tail end of this game. I have one more big side quest to do, which is important to story and lore. And then I'm going to try and fight the final boss of this game tonight, too. Mm -hmm. oh, let's see here. Oh, never mind. I'm not. Okay, never mind. According to the cheating Nintendo hotline, I can't believe I pressed A of all the buttons. Never mind. I wasn't supposed to do that. Hello, Chibi. You're in Bowser's castle? Nice. Nice, dude. So one more small stream time and you'll definitely beat that game. You have to think of something else to do if you want to if you want to stay on for longer after after you whoop Bowser's booty. Metal Gear Solid One. Wow, Hito was also playing Metal Gear Solid One recently. It, it's funny. We're so we're so like intertwined as a big community now with how far we've come as New York streamers and branching out and meeting each other. It's funny how we're so intertwined that we have we have like families of games going on. Like Pete did Paper Mario a few weeks ago, you're doing Paper Mario. Hito did Metal Gear Solid 1, you're doing Metal Gear Solid 1. It's kind of funny. Does that mean no more iTouch games? I don't know about that. Prop no, they'll probably keep iTouch games because again, the iPhone can do anything the iPod Touch could. It's just, the, 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 the iPod Touch was just great for people who weren't an Apple user and just wanted the music properties. I have to go down this hole, actually, is what I had to figure out. Oh. Awkward. Ow. But yeah, so in other news today, I learned the iPod Touch is, um, is, uh, dying. Which is, uh, very sucky. No problem, bubs. 
And I, I, again, people with iPhones may laugh at me, like, who actually buys an iPod Touch? I'm like, well, I, I, I did. I liked it, because I'm an Android user, but I still liked what iTunes does. And I'm not, and I was telling my chat this earlier, I'm not subscribed to any music service like Spotify or, or Apple Music. I don't like paying monthly subscriptions. Monthly subscriptions are never really my thing, per se. So I just like owning music outright on iTunes. And that's what, of course, I would use my iPod Touch for, just storing all my iTunes stuff I built up over the years and years. But now... Yeah, I'm sorry, I have to kill another cat on camera. <laughs> Fuck Apple Judo! It's good to see you. Oh boy. The thing the thing is that they announced this at the worst time. The iTouch kids too. <laughs> they announced this at the worst fucking time because ow. That's kinda scary, relax. Because I literally... Because I literally... My, my iPod Touch of like six and a half years literally kicked the bucket recently. So I was like literally like, okay, the, well the iPod Touch is still around, I'll just buy another soon. When I'm, when I feel comfortable with my money. And it's like, well, fuck now. I so so then I was going over the logistics of it. It's like they the newest version of the iPod Touch was released back in 2019. So they haven't released a new version of it for 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 three years. And basically it's like, well, I, I could obviously just buy one of those seven gen iPod touches before they run out. I mean it's fine. I don't the only thing is though it'll stop having support way sooner and I mean, I don't really care. I don't usually use the iPod Touch much more for just recording videos, taking pictures, or just listening to music, and I can do all that intermittently, so it's fine. I don't need to play apps on it. I'm not really an app gamer. It's just... And now what? Now what? Do I just buy an iPhone now? What if I don't act upon this right now? Do I just buy an iPhone when I eventually do want another music player? Because right now, I don't really have to bring a music player on the road for my life situation at the moment. I mean, it would be nice, but I don't have to. I can just listen to my music when I'm at my desk. <sighs> oh, it did? Oh, that's rough news to hear, Judo. I'm sorry, man. Here I am complaining about first world fucking iPod touch problems. And a good buddy of mine caught COVID. Well, my heart's with you, buddy. All the strength I can give. Oh, okay. Those monkeys came out of nowhere. Oh, okay. Well, that uh, of course, that's at least good to hear. So it's like, I mean, I don't want to buy like a new iPhone because new iPhones are way more expensive than the iPod. The iPod Touch was the perfect device for people who just who wants a music player and just a smart device that isn't like a full phone because they already have another full phone of another company. And it's, I guess Apple's like, no, it's it's iPhone or nothing. <laughs> well, I mean, hey, we're not all excited for work, but we do need that money. A blue gemstone? What the hell is that? Wait, a gemstone? Isn't that a... Isn't that a... Um... Yeah, it's a triple tech thing. But don't... Oh, yeah, I'm not gonna... I'm not... If I buy an iPhone, of course, it won't have a network bill on it. No, but iPhones are still way more expensive. Like, the iPod Touch was a nice, comfortable 200 bucks. And you got something that works, like, as a really good half-weight smart device. I mean, I know you can just say, yeah, we'll just do that. Just buying, like, an off-handed iPhone or that's, I don't know, it's... My heart is split into two. Marley is taking quite a bean. She is, but she's a tough girl. She can take it. A Zodiac cape? Wait, who wears capes? It's, um... 
Oh no, a cape is a no. That's not a ring. Or is it? I fucking forget. No, no. I was gonna say no. Wait, Magus wears capes, right? Like fucking Edgy McGee. Or not. I guess I'm tripping. Hold on one second. As you see, I'm in shambles from the iPhone announcement. Or the iPod Touch announcement. It is a cape. Who the fuck? Magic Defense Plus 10. Oh, wait, it's Frog. Frog quicks capes too, doesn't he? I, I mean, I love this character, right? Who equips this item? Like, I'm not- I'm not blind, am I? I'm not seeing a Z on the menu here. It's not- I don't think it's her. Is it just Chrono or something? Wait, it's her? Okay. I mean, it's a good... Reduces fire damage, though. But overall magic defense. Oh, okay. I'm, I'm, I... Okay, Ailey, you don't wear capes. You have, like, a little, like, scarf in, like, the back of your, like, shoulder shawl, but you don't wear capes. Fucking... Fucking this dude wears capes. You tell me he can't equip it? This is not my fault. This makes no fucking sense. I am not molding for no reason. This makes no fucking sense. Then just buy one now while you can. The technology goes only available. Look at the secondhand PS3s. Yeah, I know. I guess that's what I was trying to say. I, I'm worried this might turn to a secondhand PS3 sort of deal. Calm down, Grandpa. Ugh. <laughs> <sighs> Oh, you're using electric maelstrom already? That's fast. Well, it may not be the greatest use of uh, magic, we'll use in Oral World. No other device lets you play Tales of Exilia. I mean, that's true. <laughs> but it's like. I, I don't know why I did that. Oh, you know what? Grinding. Whatever. I'm fucking grinding. Who cares? Oh, boy. You saw Doctor Strange 2 today. I've heard slightly mixed things about that movie. Like... It's still a Marvel movie, like, yeah, it's still making money hand over fist and shit. Well, except for, like, Morbius, but it's not Morbius. But uh, I haven't heard super spoilers, but a couple of my coworkers weren't thrilled with the movie. And neither was one of the podcasters I watched, also. You're grinding your gears about that can say a secondhand iPhone. I. <sighs> But I like to buy things new. I am. I, I know. I do acknowledge. I'm grinding my gears. It's just <laughs> why. I don't take the iPod Touch from me, Lavos. I can't. I can't go on. No, that's not true. Frog would want me to go on. Okay, buy a new copy of Skies of Arcadia. Damn, dude, trying to kill me. Uh, let me not. I'm guessing I go down there at some point. Oh, so you weren't exactly, like, popping off either. It wasn't, like, the greatest thing since sliced bread. Buy a new first-gen PC. Oh, my God. Those things must be super rare. Jesus. 
It would be nice to play PS2 games extremely easy just through HDMI. But I do have the, I do have the ability to play PS2 games, or I, I think I do. I actually haven't really tested out the device. As much as I have to get to the Kim Possible game, which I kept mentioning for a year now, I I've been a little lazy, admittingly. I I gotta I gotta play the Kim Possible PS2 game. I did. Yeah. I, yeah. I mean, yeah, Judo, yeah. Fucking apple. It negated WandaVision's redemption arc. Oh, so it has something. Oh, you know what? That's something another friend of mine was asking. Does that does that have anything to do with WandaVision? Is Wrathband the thing that makes you Oh. Berserk? But you can't control yourself or something? Oh, 80% counterattack rate. Nah, I'm good. Uh, technically, technically, the Kim Possible PS2 game has been on the back burner longer. Oh, come on, man. I kind of wish this game was a little more lenient with the fight triggers. Like, come on, man. Oh, whatever. We're grinding, I guess. It actually has a lot to do with WandaVision. Okay, well, I never saw WandaVision. I'm going to be honest, which may be a little sacral to say, I think I'm slightly falling out of MCU movies. Or I don't think I'm, like, ever going to see, like, all of them, like... Because now in order to understand Doctor Strange 2, I have to watch WandaVision. WandaVision doesn't really interest me. Oh god, she's- she's dying. I'll just watch the ones that I'm definitely, like, seeing with friends in person. Without items, I may have to go a little higher to compensate. That's okay. That's fine. Well, even then, I'm guessing Lavos is in some sort of final dungeon, and I'm I'm currently getting getting levels right now, so it's all it's all good. But thank you, thank you for the info. Because again, what I'm doing all is technically optional. I was just wondering. How much of the game expect to scale up regarding such? Okay. Well, you popped a chair. Oh, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, I forgot you don't really watch MC movies. Did you like Guardians of the Galaxy 1? That's one of the more humorous, obviously quirky ones. It's still a good movie, though. Oh, you watched 1 and 2. Do I want to fight these guys? Oh, it's rare enemies. Okay, yeah, yeah, hell yeah, I do. Hell yeah, I do. Oh, oh, it's one of these guys. What are they worth, 1,500? No, they're just worth 1,000. Uh, but still, I barely have to equip an egg, or I didn't have to equip an accuracy ring. I think I can kill them with one attack from Aloy or Chrono. Wish me luck. Uh, that's definitely dead. <laughs> that's definitely dead. <laughs> Alrighty. I sort of forgot about those guys. I see. This is the other side, right? Uh... Well, it's a save point, at the very least. Hmm. 
I don't want to go in there. <laughs> I lied. Just kidding, JK. I don't want to go in there. I want to say I missed something down the other path. If that's the correct path to go. I did! My senses were tingling. My, uh, doing the dungeon bright senses were tingling. Okay, that was scary. Okay. <laughs> I was thinking, uh, let's, uh, let's spread out some... Let's spread out some... I wish I was a shield capsule, but it's not. Let's spread out some uh, capsules, shall we? Magic capsule. Well, I guess we can go down the list. Why not, right? Well, Ayla does sort of use magic because I think her kiss is affected by magic, so... Magic even helps Ayla. Magic just helps everyone in this game. I thought Marley's speed was 10 the last time I gave her a speed capsule. Oh, uh, whatever. Strength capsule. We have enough for, like, pretty much everybody. Cool. What will I stream after this? I'm half still deciding, to be honest. I have to... I mean, it won't, I don't think it'll be necessarily the next, next thing, but I have to work on a very much requested, and cash point in, to be fair, Terraria playthrough, which is a... Make an online co-op mining while well, it's like a, one of those resource games like Minecraft it's just it's just it's just pixel Minecraft I had to play one of those games all the way through the end and air quotes in end because it's very unspecific about end but I have to see through to the end but a lot of my community is going to be joining me so at least it'll be fun they'll be right by my side they're the frog that's keep me strengthened since I did all that level uh, statting up I will um I will save. Oh, uh, that's something I have to plan this spring because my again, well again I put it I was supposed to do it last year, but my life got busy, so. So yeah. Oh, uh, to be honest, I might I have to go back though. I have to go back to Arceus. I have to actually do some of the bonus content in that game. I just wanted a breather from it. Oh my sweet lord. It's it's the thing again. Is it, oh, is this a palette swap of the thing? I'll, I'll fight you. Let's go. I sword too, baby. Wow, she does good damage for only being three, like, MP used. Alright, well, it's gonna do the devastating move again, so I, I have to be prepared with Aura Whirl. I mean, maybe I can get off one more Ice Sword? I'll get off one more Ice Sword and then take whatever dishes out. Alright, I'll just take it, it's fine.
Oh, wow, really? That was nothing. Oh, it's a fire attack! Holy fuck, those ruby vests are good as fuck. Oh my god, those ruby vests are good as fuck. Don't eat her. That's obviously your most that's obviously your most scary attack, to be honest. I'll actually use Aura World for this, funnily enough. Oh, okay, and now it's just waiting five seconds again. We should really be able to kill this thing, I think. It can't have that much health, right? Right? Uh, I guess my better judgment, I'm just gonna wait, I guess. Honestly, his eating attack is more scary than the flame countdown. See, that's, see, that's what I think. Like, oh, I fucking killed him. Right. I'm, I'm happy, I guess. See, that triple kick did 1,800 damage, or maybe 19, counting the extra digits. That did, like, 1,900 damage for 20 MP, though. Cat attack was just doing 1,000 for 3. Like, as you see, I'm not super impressed by triple kick. I think the damage scaling is hella not worth it, just to just use. Check the meme session? Uh, sure, one sec. It's not that I don't trust the meme, it's that I, I'm display capturing my screen, so... <laughs> Dr. Patrick... <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> Judo! <laughs> Judo, oh my god, dude. Oh, you are a meme funny wizard. Your editing skills have gone fantastic, and I was mentioning, uh, I, I should have mentioned earlier, that I've been sort of trying to keep up with their YouTube videos, too. Oh my, that's some fine Judo editing. <laughs> much, uh, much, much chef kiss. <laughs> oh my god, that's great. <laughs> Did I miss final kick? No, I actually, I never, I actually, I actually, I totally forgot to use my triple kick, uh, my triple tech. I just finished it off with a, actually, Ayla's, um, well, this triple kick. You mean, like, the other version, right? I was gonna say, I, I'm not super impressed with this move alone, like, from a, a lone standpoint. Because I was saying, this move, like, only did 1,900 to that monster, to that boss, for 20 MP, when Cat Tech was doing 1,100 for 3. Like, the scaling doesn't super add up. I'm gonna go back and save. Judo, that, that is great. And it did... <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Holy fuck, dude. If I post that on Twitter, obviously, I'll, I'll definitely credit you. <laughs> obviously. Oh my god. that That's exactly how I feel. Oh my god. I fucking love the iPod touch, dude. And it's dead. Oh, that's a big rainbow shell. Pretty big, this rainbow shell. Can we eat? No, it's not a rainbow bagel, you idiot. This thing's heavy. We won't be able to carry it ourselves. Time to get some help back at the castle. Oh, okay. Oh, the game, like, fast forward? That was a cool transition. I haven't seen the game do that yet. <laughs> well, well met. You're always welcome here. Something troubling you. Well, actually, 
I see. So you wish me to safeguard the shell until you find that island within the castle for future generations. <laughs> Grant them this small favor. It's little enough to ask. Very well. I shall have the shell brought to the castle and stored in the vault as a royal heirloom. Commander. Yes, Majesty. Go to the Giant's Claw and retrieve me that rainbow shell. I mean, what are you going to have, like, 20 people carry it? Also, technically we're traveling as a party of seven. Us seven really couldn't lift it up. What six? What 600 technology are they going to use to carry that thing? Well, I mean, ancient Egypt built the pyramid, so... We, we, I guess we had good engineering just all throughout history. I don't know what words of gratitude could possibly suffice for all you've done. Where is Frog? Oh, Frog? You want to see him? He's right here. Frog! So you aided Chrono and the others. You've done a fine service to this kingdom. Please remain here as long as you wish. Oh, he's simp- Oh! He's simping, though. Your kind words are reward enough, your majesty. And my heart is glad to hear them. It turns into his theme for the entire room? God, this guy's a fucking Chad. I love this guy. And it's funny, I hate his and I hate his descendant in Cross, so go figure. Spoiler alert, he has a descendant in Cross. I hate his descendant in Cross, but I actually really love this guy. <laughs> He's cool. Ba ba ba. I, I know, I know it's rough. A hey, future me, if you're watching this VOD, or anyone out there who's an iPod Touch user, I know it's gonna be rough without our iPod Touches. I'm still broken up inside, but we have to move on somehow. It, 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 Apple can't take away our own music. We are not gonna succumb to streaming services. We will fully own our music, and we'll play it any way, shape, or form we can. Even if we have to perfectly preserve an old iPod Touch in storage. All right. Whew. Oh, is that the actually I load I have to check the uh, Nintendo hotline. That can't be it for Yeah, this is just the first part of the quest. Oh, never mind. We're only halfway through Marley's quest. Her quest is long as fuck. If if I if I request you to react to a jackass clip, will you uh, accept? I mean, it's on YouTube, so it's allowed in some way, shape, or form. Yeah, I, I guess so. I mean, yeah, it's, as long as it's a YouTube video, yeah. If it's if it's suitable for YouTube, it's suitable for on stream. I mean, that's not kind of always the case, but I mean, it it ninety nine point nine percent of the time that's that is the case. So, yes, by by the laws of regulation, I can accept. <laughs> Oh my god. Yeah, get off. Yeah, fucking telling me. Okay. Uh, the spoilers for Jackass? <laughs> All right, I fucking I'm, I'm I'm sorry. I'm thinking about getting off. My bad. Spoilers for Jackass? All right, <laughs> that's a hoot. I have to go to the castle. Oh, that's wrong. Oh, I missed the scene. <laughs> Princess Nadia! Oh, wrong voice. <laughs> you had me worried, Princess. I understand your feelings, of course. The king places his realm above all else. It was the same even when your mother, Queen Eliza, passed away. What? Oh, child, forget I spoke. Tell me. 
It's difficult to speak of this even now. You see, Queen Elise's condition has been all frail for some time, but it took a sudden turn for the worst at the end. She desperately wanted to see your father just one last time. But your father refused, said he could not leave his work unattended. He left you, young and innocent, knowing nothing of the death to watch over her alone. Naturally, the end was not long in the coming. She died soon after. Alright, this plot came out of fucking nowhere. One might say the king killed her. Such a shame. Father! Please, I speak too much. I, what, what, what is this weird fucking backstory? How do you drop that on us and just leave? Okay. Oh wait, hold on, these are chests. A turbo ether? It's locked, oh. <laughs> Let me the fuck through! <laughs> Her fucking screaming animation. That's the reaction? Okay. I'll react to it in a few minutes when I get to save. Good citizens, have you heard of any royal heirloom known as the Rainbow Shell? I, too, had no idea of its existence, so I laid eyes upon this. I put a <laughs> Oh my god, CJ, I am distraught, man. As an Android user, I like having an iPod Touch, just so I can listen built to my iTunes library built up over the years, but they killed it. Oh, boy. I'm trying to be strong, but it's hard. Unveil the rainbow shell to the people at the Millennial Fair, that and that they might enjoy the blessing of our royal treasure. I have no idea what you're talking about. We have no ancient royal heirlooms here. Oh, great. He Phoenix Wright fucking stole it. Surely you don't intend to claim this is a forgery. I ask you, good people of the court, why does this defendant deny any glimpse of the rainbow shell? Why? Because he no longer owns it. He sold a priceless heirloom of our kingdom for no reason other than his own greed. Princess, we are conducting a trial. Father! Nadia, the Chancellor's trying to frame me. Let's, let's not hurl insults, you bitch. If you're innocent, it should be simple enough to confirm whether the matter of proof. Yes, his grace has not sold the heirloom and should remain within the castle. Bring me the rainbow shell before the guard. This really is Phoenix Wright. So I literally just show the exact item that can prove everything correct. Ch uh, Chancellor, what kind of trickery is this? Remove them. Entry is forbidden. Let me the fuck through! I'm sorry, my lady, but not even you may enter. Take Rainbow Shell, save Marley Father. What are you talking about? The Chancellor made up the entire thing. There is no heirloom. Marley forget? Old King Keep Shell, Rainbow Shell here now. Yeah, Marley, come on, we changed the time. Hello? Get with the program, girl. Oh, no, she's an airhead. And not the mystery flavor kind. It's probably in the basement. Let's go. Uh, can I stop derping? Thank you. The verdict's about to be handed down. The chances are that no one be allowed to enter or leave. Oh, well. Well, that fucking sucks. The icy mystery flavor? Oh, the, the, oh, the, the, the I, it tasted like lemon. Hmm. How am I supposed to concentrate on my cooking with him staring at me? Just stop complaining and hurry it up. Oh my god! Oh, this guy's caked up. Oh, a rat bit my toe. Oh. Bales? That you? Yeah, he's gonna frame the king with good old fake evidence. Yeah. <laughs> As Crystal keeps beating down on me with 85 degrees, man, I wish it would be constantly 85 where I am. Spring has been a scam. Well, I mean, it's gotten a little better these past few days, but 
So there is a plot. There is a plot to this game, and it's not just it's not just Ayla's butt. Uh, I, I, spring has been a scam in in New York so far. Like, like it has been like 50 degrees like for the past like two weeks every day. It, it definitely doesn't feel like the, the end of April, beginning of May. But finally this week, it's been more like in the late 60s. God, if uh, spring is the spring is the worst season out of the four. I am. Remember we had that discussion during uh, Pokemon Arceus. I am thoroughly convinced now. Spring is a scam. Liar, I've never seen you before. Order in the court. Heh <laughs> I was conniving. I'm convincing, wasn't I? Perfect. Would I eat fried snake? My parents have done it before, so I guess I could do it too. I mean, yes, although admittingly I shouldn't complain. It's cooler in my area, and I just- and I work inside a mall, so... I guess I can't super complain. Oh my god, look at all these fucking items. <laughs> Bazinga. Oh my lord. I, man, she was zooming! <laughs> what about kangaroo steak? I mean, I'd be down to eat any sort of steak, anything once, like ostrich or anything, sure. Do the spin. <laughs> oh, wait, they're weak enemies! I'm gonna waste the MP. Speaking of which, okay. I mean, I tried to get into a battle there. He just zoomed past me. No, this one, you idiot. Yay, the rainbow shell! Okay. Cooked cockroaches with spices. I've eaten other bugs before. But I mainly not- Wait, cock- You can really cook cockroaches? That's- That- That is scary, to be honest. Cockroaches are the most disease-written bugs in the entire world. And besides just biting into a black widow, I guess, which would probably kill you. But that's- That's kind of sus. Yeah, the Lion King. <laughs> <laughs> Eat a bunch of these bugs. It's like a, it's like a saw. It's like a saw, like trap. You have to get through. You have to eat a bunch of these bugs to get the key or something. The same way you can eat crickets. I mean, crickets aren't like super high diseased. Like, have you ever seen like a documentary on cockroaches? They are diseased as fuck. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa! I'm sorry. I'm missing the dialogue here. What are you saying, Ayla? Have baby give milk? Oh, boy. You cook the mat. I know! It's still, it's still scary! <laughs> Marley, ready, leave nest. Still small. Hey, man. Members of the jury, it's time for a verdict. If you believe the defendant guilty, stand to the left, innocent to the right. Guilty. Oh, he's dead. Objection! Hold it! I'm... As a as a roach is, so you'd be fine e if we normalized eating bugs. Uh, I mean, there's still other food in the world. I wouldn't lose sleep over it. Normalizing eating bugs doesn't get rid of my option now, so it's whatever to me. You really won't reconsider. No, princess, we won't. There's no other way then. It's a bit rough, but just follow me. Oh, really? I actually didn't really know that about bear meat. There's only one guy who thinks the king is not guilty.
The line of Gordia has ended. The kingdom shall be mine. Oh yeah, just yell that out, you idiot. Good thing these flat top dunces of henchmen and <laughs> are, are idiots. I'm concerned to say the least. Sort of, but Trump also said he wouldn't return to Twitter either way, but whether that's just hot air, who knows? It's whatever. Is Marley gonna, like... Is she... Is she outside? Okay, you're standing on nothing, Marley. Relax. Also, this is a Jesus allegory. Father! <laughs> hey, she jumps through stained glass! Like Joker! Yeah, I don't care either way, to be super honest. <gasps> Nadia! Princess! Oh, well, what if what if Persona 5 got a small inspiration from that, from this scene? See, Marley's cool. She dives through stained glass. You're too late. His grace has been found guilty. Even the king is subject to execution. No, not when the whole thing is a setup. I mean, what are you going to do, snap a picture of it? We don't have cameras in 1000 AD. Although we have time machines, it's weird. And escalators that crunch people's legs. Don't, don't think about it too hard. The treasure's right here. Impossible. Give it up, Chancellor. Your scheme has failed. We just asked to help. <laughs> I know. I'm just making a fucking joke. You're the ones who had better give up. If I can't avenge my answers the easy way, I'll do it now the hard way. Super Ultra Presso Transformo. Oh, shit! It's the first boss of the game. He's probably a lot harder, though. Yeah, never trust Chancellors, exactly. I don't trust Chancellors. Okay, he's confused, that's fine. Well, you missed, but whatever, you're not hurting our own teammates. Alright, I'll do- Oh, he better not fucking resist Dark, I swear to fucking god. Alright, let's- uh, fine, we'll do the kick. I swear to god, though, if he resists dark, I'll be pretty angry. He doesn't, but- or maybe he does, and he just did damage, but... Wait, weakness? That was a decent attack. 666, six, six, by the way. I mean, that's pretty decent. It's pretty decent. Again, you can do you can do lesser powerful you can for for better MP scaling, you can do better moves though. Like some of some of the late moves don't super scale well, at least at least from, from what I'm seeing so far in my combination. Maybe other party combinations are better. Put the chance on your party. Oh god. Who needs to resist elements? Marley's doing just fine. Uh, uh, statuses. Marley's just doing that fine at it. No, not again. Ow. That was easily strong. Oh. 
Oh, you die from that. Oh, you had a fu you had a fuck you attack when you die. That sucks, dude. Father. No, don't say it. I was wrong to be so stubborn. No, I didn't even think about how you must have felt. Oh, I know what you want to say, but the words just won't come out. It's the same for me. There was a time I truly thought you were lost to me. But when I think about it now, I realize it was I who abandoned you. The, your, yeah, your interesting daddy issue art came up mad fast. I'll ask you for advice, and you can tell Chrono about... And tell you about Chrono and ask you about Mother and... Okay, Marley, going off airhead. Oh, your mother, Eliza. I'm ashamed to admit it, but it's taken me until now to understand what she meant by those final words. Someday when Nadia's older, she'll bring someone she loves to... Oh... Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> you heard her last words? Good. Of course. You were so young, you probably don't remember. You kept saying, Daddy, I love lots of people, and lots. I reassured your mother, seeing you so happy, she left us with a smile on her face. So that's how it was. Yes. I used to call you daddy. I mean, out of context, this line is really bad or good, depending. I need, I need like a print screen of that line. You did. I'm sorry, daddy, for everything. Oh, I still have to watch your video redemption. I, I will do that. But it seems we're finally done with this quest. I give you permission to leave the castle, but I expect the utmost caution from you. I mean, if we never came back, it wouldn't have fucking mattered. Why are you giving- why are you trying to be a father now? You're too late. No worry. Ayla protect Marley. Oh, uh, who's that voice? Melchior! Oh, it's Melchior. Can't be letting you have all the fun. Let's see some armor from that rainbow shell. Find time for me to do something again. Watch and learn. Oh. I mean, that's true. I guess I can forge something from it, just like Dross. Um, I'll probably Nintendo Hotline how to do that. If I, if you had the power to increase Disney's stock value by a thousand percent, but they had to make a theatrical portion and his friends, do you think they would go for it? Um. Also, oh, porn can't be released in theater nowadays. <laughs> But you mean a canon? Yeah, but I was say you're a little late there, buddy. Porn isn't released in theaters anymore. <laughs> but they had to make a canon porn film of Mickey Mouse. I don't think they would go. I mean, they're they're rich enough already. They don't fucking care. I mean, they get rich, sure, but at, at what point do you just not fucking care? <laughs> Oh, okay. Actually, there's something cool I've got to do in the castle, according to Nintendo Hotline. <laughs> oh, I think I ran up the, the wrong way. Oh wow, a mega elixir. Holy fuck these items. It's not like I use items, but holy fuck. Use the stick. I mean, I don't think Disney I mean if you're if you're if you if you really want me to think about it like really logistically, no, I don't think I don't think Disney would really go for that. Like if, like, if I'm being, like, dead-ass thinking about it, no, I wouldn't think they would go for that. 
They 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 they're literally like they're so rich they can practically own land. Or they tried to own land at one point. Like a straight up separated country. So I I think they're fine. Maybe they'll do other things for money, maybe a lesser value for something less stark, but Well, they still do. I mean, yes, but... Oh, thank goodness that beast locked me up here. Princess Naughty and friends. Wait, I don't have time for this. I must prepare the Moonlight Parade. But Moonlight Parade? Okay, relax, dude. Uh, let me just complete the last of this small side quest where I forge something. Then I'll finally do your video reaction, I promise. <laughs> oh, I, oh, never mind. I wasn't supposed to leave the castle either. Fuck this place. What if I threaten to give Marvel to Paramount? Oh, Disney love does love Marvel though. They they pro I mean I mean again, I have to think realistically. They would probably find some way to evacuate you from the board. They would probably find some way to oust you. Rather than make the porn. Now, now, if you have, like, plot armor and can get away with it, sure, then you just reach the ending you want, but... Again, I'm trying to think super logistically. To be honest, no, they would probably oust you in some way. And then you'd have to turn to the Green Goblin and kill them. The properties of this material are quite unique. I can craft armor from it that'll damage the effects of magical attacks. I can also make you a highly effective prismatic dress. Or I can make you three less effective prismatic helms. Oh, well, I have to decide now. Fuck. Fuck. Oh, fuck. Let's go one. Only women can equip it. Yes, I want the dress. Very well. My work is complete. Oh, you get them like one at a time? Okay, fuck. Yeah, I know. So again, I'm, I'm I'm trying to think about the best possible way. Like, oh, that prismatic dress. Holy fuck, dude. She really will be nigh unkillable. <laughs> I mean, why not? I mean, again, you you could you could you could just have plot armor and say you get away with it, sure. But if I'm thinking logistically. Yeah, that's what I was thinking too. That's why I'm like, let's go with the let's go quality over quantity. That's a that's a classic quality over quantity conundrum. So I my mind went quality. But no, my honest take was that no, they would oust you in some way. If there was financial incentive to make a Mickey Mouse porn, they would have done it by now. They clearly either don't want to do it or executes people who do suggest it. Prism Spectacles. All right, what's this baby do? Or you're making something else. Holy fuck, dude. My work is complete. Obtained rainbow. Okay.
Oh, it's a sword. 70% critical hit rate. Whoa. Oh, it's a sword. I was like, I was hella confused. They couldn't say rainbow blade or something? All right, whatever, man. Oh, the swallow, man. Shout out to the homie Surge, though. All right, let's see where this leaves me off. Uh, wait, what do the spectacles do? Greatly boost damage. Oh, perfect! That's what your item, quip item, does already, but you have the extreme version of it. Yeah, I'm a little confused myself. I... I think this is a little fuck up in the text, but... I'm glad I realized it was a sword. It can't just say rainbow blade or sword or something? Alright, whatever, man. Whatever, man, you do you. <laughs> hey, Mike. Good to see you. Whatever. Whatever. No, I mean that comment. Oh. Say I'm a crazy rich lending corporate takeover in a 30 chain project. Harris likes to imagine a lot of fake scenarios. He just gets off to that. No, no, and well, no. If I if I had control over Disney, we would have Mickey Mouse crossing over with Love Live, baby. You you can't. There's no way. The, you the no no one would be on your side for that. Again, if you have plot armor, sure you can get away with that. But logistically speaking, you don't. <laughs> no, poor old oil tycoon. Oy, oy, oy. I mean, I do love Frog, don't get me wrong. But he had his time in the sun. Alright, we are, we are ready for the uh, final d d stretch of the boss area of the game. I mean, fine, whatever. Get your Mickey Mouse porn. That's that's a normie idea anyway. Anime girls are the future. It's a bad investment. Anime girls are the future. Yeah, get off. Yep, you know it. Yes, I'm suddenly like triple downing on that joke tonight. It's one of the last times we'll get to see it. But your head cold is mostly gone. I'm still gonna rest up with your monster on the horizon and then I'd be down to clown in spooky town. Oh, you mean phasmophobia. Yeah, I got you, homie. No problem, just let me know. Yeah, I was like, can we just kill them? <laughs> Alright, so according again, I'm still sort of reading the Nintendo hotline in order to do this ending properly. I have to go to 1,600 and BC, 12,000 BC in that order. Okay. The future student loan poor. <laughs> Oof, you're right though. Ouch, my pain. Uh, stop, man. It's too real. Stop. <laughs> oh, the Disney Star Wars Holiday Special. All right, so we have to go to 1,000, which we are in. So what, we just, we crash into the main thing? I kind of wish, I really wish the map updated to show where the main thing was. More than Elden Ring? I would, because there's like 12 endings, oh my lord, that, it, the, this thing looks like it has eyes on the bottom, like that looks creepy, half cut off. I mean, it, I mean, I'm just making sure I do the g g general good ending properly, that's all. 
But yes, again, old JRPGs were archaic, so admittedly I'm using a little bit of a hotline help to make sure I just do this right the first time. Because time is, is, a valuable, is a valuable commodity. I also put shell points in to make him play a game that might rip his beard out. Really? What beard? Uh, well, I mean, no, no, not what beard here. I mean, what game? <laughs> and kill the bad guy as a baby. That's sort of what you're doing. I mean, that's sort of what you're doing. He he doesn't destroy, while well, the bad guy isn't is a parasite, it's not really a human, but he, he, he kills the world in one, in 1999. I know, it's kind of, this game always struck me as interestingly weird because it uses a real life year that we're aware of. No, he kills the world in 1999. We're undoing it starting from the ages before. Navi attacking for round two. Oh man, the spirit is willing, but the flesh is weak. Good. Irritating stick. Are you just describing? Are you describing uh, the game title as obtusely as possible? Oh, it's a Nostradamus reference. Oh, I haven't seen that movie. The fuck Disney. Now I'm being a cute. I am cute, thank you. Oh shit, there's the epoch. This is just a jumping off point, isn't it? That isn't a movie. I thought it was I thought you were i I'm fighting a door? I'm sorry. This is just like Tales of Symphonia. <laughs> I bet Tales of Symphonia got the fucking idea from this game. Is Marley just glowing green now? <laughs> She's that powered up. I thought Notre Dame was a hunchback at Notre Dame reference. Okay, I, I I don't know what fine literature you're talking about. You lost me. No, that's actually the title, Irritating Stick. Wait, he has to move a dot to the maze, a complicated maze without touching the walls. Wait, so you mean it's the fucking impossible game? <laughs> the Flash game from like 2008? That's funny. Oh shit! It's you already. I wasn't expecting you for some reason. Fools, have you not learned your lesson? We we are made immortal. We shall live forever with Lavos, who feasts upon this planet. I was very angry with you. I mean, I don't fucking know history, man. Now he rests and gathers strength, but in a mere 999 years, he will emerge to rain destruction upon the earth and crown himself as king. Black Omen is the path which leads to Lavos, is the conduit through which our limitless power flows. As long as the almighty Lavos reigns, your dreams are for naught. Well, that's why we're in 1000. Sort of, but a more annoying level. Well, I wonder if the uh, Impossible game was inspired by that game. I didn't know there was a PS1 game with the same, like, properties. I guess we're fighting, let's go. I mean, the- okay, the impossible game is possible, you- you jokester. He was a French astrologer and seer in the 1500s who predicted that 1999 would be the end of the world. Wait, really? This game is based on a true astronomer? Astrologer? Wait, dead ass? Why is it more of the fan base talking about this? And how does CJ know that? No, I mean, it's possible they got that content from this game. Wait, what do you mean? It's history. Fuck, man. I guess I'm even worse at history than I thought. If CJ's getting one-ups on me, I mean, I'm not calling CJ dumb, but... I used the wrong fucking... I guess I deserve it. I, I'm not trying to insult CJ, but even CJ gets one-ups on me from history? Fuck, dude. <laughs> I'm worse at history than I thought. That's what you mean. I got you. Sorry. I'm again. I'm. I'm having a 
molding meltdown. I know I do, but I didn't think I was that bad. And I blame the American OW school system. Even though you guys are all Americans. Oh, you're poisoned, I see. I'm just gonna beat this guy down, I guess. I mean, I mean, do I have to save MP is the big question. Can I leave this dungeon heal right after this front room boss battle? Like, that's what I'm asking myself. Uh-oh, this is bad. Good fucking crit, even though that- oh, that did do a lot. Okay, never mind, we did it. He was only worth 900?! Alright, man. A fucking French astrologer? Why, why, oh, is that why people, is that why, like, why people are worried about Y2K? Or is that another reason? Wow, I learned all sorts of things. Wow. No, that's not the reason. We have to stop predicting years when we're gonna die. It just makes the world dumber. Yeah, I mean, I knew that part. The internet couldn't handle the date switch over, but... <laughs> we have to, we, the, the, the world gets dumber every time we predict we're gonna die. I, I, I'm dumb too, apparently. I, I mean, I'm part of the world also. I'm dumb too. Current event on this guy. I didn't realize this guy was that famous. I mean, yeah, I remember. I remember that part. I just thought maybe that's something to do with Notre Dame also, because 1999 was so close to 2000. That's it, it, apparently. Apparently, I learned something during my Chrono Trigger playthrough. And how does killing a baby or whatever CJ said have to do with Notre Dame anyway? Oh, because he predicted 1999 or something. Yeah, whatever. Oh, it's the shield guy's cool. We haven't seen these guys in forever. Don't throw poo balls at me, thank you. Wrong enemy. Oh, you have lock? Oh, I, oh well, that's not great. I mean, whatever. I don't use items anyway. I... Okay, I'm glad I attacked the wrong person. Thanks, Xbox controller. You little sleepy there, Chrono? Hmm. He made a bunch of prophetic poems, and this is what he said about 1999. I'll have to read that later, but I am interested, don't get me wrong. Oh, I never reacted to fucking Harris's jackass stunt. Yeah, I guess I'll do that now, one sec. Well, okay, I guess next save point. Sorry, I had a fucking meltdown about me not knowing history. Okay, now we now, now we have big chungos here. Ow. That's a lot of damage. Alright, stop, that's a lot of damage. Please. Ow. 
Oh, hey, ZY. Nice seeing you, homie. Well, I beat Marley's side quest. It was pretty interesting. It was it was nice seeing the rainbow equipment since I know, I since I know of it from Chrono Cross. It was nice seeing that brought to life in this game as its original intended. And now I'm just gonna f do all the zeals I have to do, or the black omens. What do you want to call them? I am I admittedly I'm still slightly looking at the Nintendo Hotline to uh, make sure I do the black omens in the correct order for the proper good ending, because I know that's a thing. But still not spoiled. And I have to react to a Jackass YouTube video when I get the chance. By the way, do you know who Nostradamus is, ZY? Completely out of nowhere. Do you know who that is? <laughs> He's... <fun. laughs> The person that predicted everything, you do know who he is. They, so, since we were mentioning 1999 a lot in this game, my intellectual chat brought up Nostradamus, and I thought they were talking about the fucking hunchback in Notre Dame. Am I actually main character dumb? Oh, no. <laughs> I mean, I'm the main character, but I'm dumb. Fuck. I had no idea who that is, and my entire chat pretty much knows because they're intellectual chads, apparently. STOP SHOOTING ME! STOP IT! Oh, we need to revive her. Okay, well, I never expected her to die in a normal battle. Stop it! Alright, we have to use a Rise on her. Did you do Ayla's side quest? Yes, I did. Well, her side quest is just literally going up to the- the- her hut and buying ruby vests, which have been very useful for the sons of a gun. Well, the son of a gun. I'm sorry, son of a son. I'm fuck. I uh, stop shooting me. I, this thing is annoying the shit out of me. I need to kill this thing now. Stop it! Not that thing. I was- oh, no. Okay. Oh, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. We're not fine. Fucking glitch battle system again. Please stop. I'm gonna die. I can't believe I'm gonna die. Glitch battle system again. I have to read. No, I don't have to redo the boss. I entered the room back and forth. Also, I did save. Wow, fucking glitch battle system. Okay, that. Okay, Dalton was fine because he was relatively harmless. That actually really fucking sucks. Oh, wait. Uh, no, I saved. I saved. I didn't know I can land there. Even then, I can just continue. I think, unless I overwrite it here. No, I, I don't overwrite it. Okay, great. Well, that fucking sucks. I have to just redo some of these battles against whatever. I'm gonna reach that save point before I react to the content, though. What do you want me to grind? The Nintendo uh, hotline did already uh, tell me what to do, but yeah, but thank you, ZY. I mean, it sort of just makes sense from a story standpoint too. Even I'm I'm smart enough to figure that out. If if Lavos destroys the world in 1999, just start destroying the Black Omens from the past backwards. Oh boy. That thing's the final boss, apparently. <laughs> Remember those Elder Lava spawns? Well, you mean like the shell things? Yeah. 
Oh yeah, that's right. This thing, these thing, these, these guys conk. That's right. I forgot. Try to steal them. They give haste helms. Permanent haste. Huh? That's pretty dope. Is it worth it taking off the helm, which guards against status helmets? Even though I don't really use that, that helm. And I Ayla, and uh, uh, Marley does have the uh, prismatic dress. Oh, don't, I mean, yes, uh, don't get me wrong. Haste is extremely good in this game. I'm definitely not saying no. It's like the speed boots from Xenogears. What do you mean, how? I mean, yeah, who knows what other battle is glitched in this game. Yeah, I know what you mean, I know what you mean. You were insulting my, my JRPG or ATB skills. There's just apparently two battles in this game that are horrifically glitched. I don't know if there's a fan mod that fixes it. That's slightly disconcerting. <laughs> Chuck E. Cheese after <laughs> Chuck E. Cheese after he was Five Nights at Freddy's. Nice. You know I should be healing. I should be healing. Oh, yeah, this this is where it is. And also, I can't just aim for this stupid-ass flying bitch again. That was also my big problem. This thing's the goddamn devil. Don't Xbox controller me, please. Uh, and well, considering this was pre-Bomberman 64, Bomberman 64 is a ripoff of this. Alright, there we go. We, we beat the last boss. You're so OP for this. I mean, until the game decides to scam me, I am. Alrighty. Uh, Harris, are you around? Because if you are, your your reward redemption is pretty much coming up. I look, Frog's in the party momentarily to heal using his own MP. You're here? Okay, great. Alright, one sec. Alright, we can top and take a breather. YouTube, you're gonna miss some, like... Well, you can't be horse balls. It's on YouTube. Who knows what jackass son you're having me react. It's probably something regarding physical comedy. No, there's, there won't be horse balls or anything. You can't show that on YouTube. So whatever it is, it's at least stream acceptable. Putting it in big air quotes. All right. See ya. Hey, YouTube, what up? You didn't miss anything. What up? All right, we're, we're back at it. And the next day. And the next day. Oh, shit, it's Bakusan. What up, dude? You going to bed? Okay, take it easy. Hey, what up? Oh, it's th this goddamn menace. <laughs> what, what? Oh, I'm fighting the walls again. Weird. That is definitely light damage. Because Chrono took the least amount of that. How's Chrono Trigger? I'm very much enjoying it. I'm at the tail end of this game. I can probably beat the final boss tonight, but then do the extra content in another stream, and that'll be it. I will have a, I will have popped my Chrono Trigger cherry completely. Again, very... in. Oh, that was it? I thought there was four things to attack. All right, whatever. Again, very interesting, just knowing how long this game has been in the back of my mind to play for... Two decades, pretty much. Ever since I became a Chrono Cross fan.
Frog makes the best. I, I fell in love with a lot of the characters in this game. Even if we meme about Luca, I still got to learn more about her. It feels good, man. Oh god, I'm fighting dark matter? Oh lord. Oh no, it's a Locky. Okay. All right, we're busting. Let's go. Good fucking crits, dude. Set a 70%, not a scam. All righty. More of these homies, all right. Good crit. A wild goomy. Uh, good old Kirby's Dreamland 3. Good hit. You escaped? All right, that's fine. I still get EXP, right? Yeah, still get a little. All right, cool. Bye, dude. Take it easy. Deuces. Why? why? Okay. It's... These things, I mean, unless I'm going to eat my fucking words, these things aren't really harmful per se. It's just, okay. Sure, man. You can paste this out. Sure. You could fucking miss. Cool. Ugh. All right, those just escape at this rate. Yeah, okay, bye. Whatever. Whatever. <laughs> oh! Well, I haven't seen one of these things in forever. They used to be pink in the first, like, well, the second, like, dungeon. Oh man, they're they're really going to town. We do be critting a little. attack, man. I mean, I guess it's supposed to be a tongue, but man, that fucking attack. You dead? You dead. All right, good. I didn't was in the mood to hear Marley during the battle anyway. I am in the mood during the, um, during the, um, menu, though. All right, cool. All righty. So this dungeon's really just sort of a straight path. I mean, I'm down, but... Oh, you stole MP? Oh, no. Oh, no. You stop that immediately. <clears throat> Please stop that. I didn't mean to attack that. Fuck.
<laughs> by making you not a chance. Okay. I mean, these guys give so much EXP. I'm already, like, level 50, like... I guess I wouldn't... Should, I guess with doing all the side quests and this, I shouldn't have been worried about being underleveled. If max HP is 999 in this game, which I'm sort of guessing it is, Ail is about to fucking hit it. Chrono's not too far behind. Oh! Okay, interesting room. Oh no, it's this again. And maybe it'll be a nice, pleasant elevator ride with no. Oh. They reskin Gato? That's interesting. Okay, I didn't see that one coming, to be honest. Oh, don't you fucking start. Don't you fucking start. Oh, no. Fuck, dude. Good crit, though. I need to heal her right now. Nice. Cure 1 does all the healing for me. I don't even need Cure 2. I guess that's not really a good point in Marley's favor, but yeah. You finished Dream Daddy yesterday? Nice, dude. Way to go. Oh, ow. Fuck, dude. Max Thatcher, 9999999. Okay, that's what I thought. Gonna head the bat? Okay, night. Even though you tried to scam me. Gonna do Steam World Quest, all right. Also, I can't really look at that Twitter right now. You have to, you have to tell me what it is. Oh no! All right, so Marley is the only one who can get an attack through, essentially. Okay. Or I have to just get lucky and have the confused characters attack a robot, which she did. Way to go! No one cares about that game anymore. That's not a reason to not stream it. You never know who you'll meet by playing any sort of game. Oh, thank fucking God. Oh, wow. All right, I guess it's just the Marley show, I guess. Ow. Good crit. Good crit. Good miss. Bad miss. Oh, boy.
Okay. Good crit. Let's go. Is there more? Okay, no. Thank, thank God. Yeah, go fuck yourself, game. Well, maybe there is more. Maybe they're just giving me a chance to heal. There is. Okay, but it's not fucking two Gatos reskinned. It, it, it's the chunky guys that pick you up. These guys are fucking annoying, but... I'll be doing this again? Fuck, this is long, though. Fuck, maybe I won't finish the game tonight. Oh, whatever. Oh, cool. Good, now the game can go fuck itself. Oh. Fuck. I had something. All right, whatever. I mean, this is a good level up point, to be honest. We're fucking bussing in levels. Do I have to fight the walls again? I'm still not forgetting about that. Mega elixir, cool. Don't care. Oh, it's these things. These things suck MP. I have to be careful. Time stop? Oh no. Not the world. I think thing's dead as fuck. I guess steal from Chrono. I kind of wish you stole it from Ayla, because that MP's lesser value, but whatever. I guess beggars can't be choosers. I fucking Xbox controlled the wrong fucking target. Please kill him. Like, right now. Thank you. All right, cool. Yeah, I got stuff. Cool, whatever. All right, we actually barely took any damage. Oh, that's a lot of fucking gold, but <clears throat> I barely need it. Oh, okay. What is this, Triclide from fucking Mario 2? All right, let's go. I mean, I'm down. Oh, well, these guys suck MP. I have to be careful. Oh, we kill them? We just kill them? We're just gonna kill them? 
Let's go. Oh, fuck. All right, here we go again. Good crit. All right, that's dead. Oh, it's not. Really? I thought the things had less than a thousand. Oh, fuck. You know what? What you know? What's one thing I sort of noticed about the character action of this game? When Marley legitimately misses, she giggles to herself. No other character has an after miss animation, at least from what I'm looking at. That's a very nice touch to her uh, ditzy airhead character. Oh no. Oh no, it's the final boss. Like, what if they made, like, after miss animations for all the party members? Like, would Ayla's, like, would she, like, stomp the ground, like, angry, like, grr? They have Cassie. <laughs> oh, man, I love KFC. I'm so happy that our fine American culture of KFC is there. I know, right? I mean, it is sort of hilarious in a way, but I mean, look at us. We we we, we take part in Japanese culture. We watch their anime. We jack off to their anime girls. We we play their JRPGs. Honestly, I'm actually thrilled we can give something back to them. Oh, the vigilance hat this thing sucks. Oh, no, it doesn't. I lie. I'm sorry. I lied. <laughs> What's the clear cup to? Prevents confuse. Prevents lock. Ah, oh, fuck that shit. Oh, here we go. Big Saverino. Nova armor. Mega. Nova armor. Oh. I mean, it does present, prevent all status ailments. I guess I'll wear it for three less defense. I guess. I guess, Vespi, okay? I guess, man. Apparently, status ailments are a big deal if I learn something from the confused L of... Oh, fuck. Oh, a haste helm. It's right here, actually. So it's the same- oh no wait, it's- oh, but... Oh, uh, but, hmm. Well, I mean, I guess Chrono can have it, I guess. It's the same thing. He doesn't resist shadow damage much anymore, though. I don't know how much shadow damage I have to promptly avoid in the game. Lava certainly doesn't use shadow, right? <laughs> There's no fucking way, right? Just Chad. Wait, am I allowed to go back? I'm confused. I thought he was just a rest point. Am I allowed to, like, teleport back and fully rest? Get on. Is it like a jack in the box? Oh, it is. Fuck. 
Well, how do I get back is the big question. I don't, do I? There's no get back, is there? Oh, here's another question. Oh, no, I probably have to do the elevator again. Fuck. Yeah, never mind, never mind, never mind. Never mind, that is so not worth. Oh, man, imagine, imagine if I didn't save. <laughs> I mean, I can't, again, I, I expected that. I expected that game. I'm not an idiot. I expected that game. There's no way. Yeah, you weren't going to let me heal for free. There's no fucking way. That's literally just reset the entire dungeon, essentially. That's not worth it then, because you just end up with the same MP at the end. All right, man. Whatever, dude. I did it for science, and we saw the funny Jack in the Box scene. That is true. <clears throat> Hello, Gilligan. Oh, that's well. There we go. Uh, no, I don't want to resume, because that bookmarked outside the dungeon. I want to use my hard save, please. Thank you. Alrighty, so, cool. I guess we'll go into this room. Uh, this is only completes one of them, so, alright, we'll see what awaits us. I'm excited. Oh, fuck. Now you're just reusing rooms, man. This is just the Ocean Palace. Yeah. Does he counterattack or something? He does. Fuck off. Oh, wow. Okay. We do. We Ayla literally just ate him alive, like like literally. Okay. sucks. Damn, I'm not done? Alright, well, MP conservation is... Oh, no. Oh, no. It's the two gods, but I'm ready this time. I'm ready this time, though. Hey, it's good to see you, Silver! Oh, you guys are raiding me. You guys are too kind. I hope you guys had a fun night of Splatoon 2. I was just craving some more Chrono Trigger in my schedule. Yes, me, the JRPG genius. You know it. All right, let's give these homies some good shout out. I have to old tab the. Uh. Glad you guys had fun. All right, let's go. Mister Rose, I'll I'll be there next time, or or I'll just be there in Splatoon three at this rate. You like eggs? Well, you're crazy and chicken. That's what I see. I'm sorry, chicken chimkin. Again, I I can't read. <laughs> I can't read. Let's give a nice shout out to Shell first. I mean, I should go. With, no, I'm sorry, Silver first. What am I doing? Splatoon! Chad! Chad, it's good to see you, buddy. It's good to see you. I can't wait for our uh, talk we're going to do with Shell in the future. I don't know if he like, fully announced yet. I don't want to give away too many details. You tried to bring the roll up this good? No problem, Maple. No problem. For those who don't know me, my name is Matt Big Fat. While well, I'm giving all the shoutouts. I'm a good buddy. I'm a good in real life buddy of Shell and Silver. I, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a great New Yorker just like them. Uh, they're furiously typing at the moment to tell me that's not true. But I love these guys to death. And I also stream Nintendo, uh, PlayStation, and PC games. Right now, you happen to catch me in a classic, classic Chrono Trigger playthrough. I'm experiencing this game for the first time, because I've only played its spiritual sequel and not its uh, prequel. So it's about time I solve that. Ew, New York, I know, right? That's not. <laughs> uh, uh, okay, so yes, yeah, so you currently see me near the end of the game. Not super final boss yet, but we're getting there. Oh, no problem, Shad. Love you, buddy. I can't wait for my. I can't wait to use uh, the roller in Splatoon 3, man. 
All right. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh God, these. Oh, by the way, if you hear any, uh, if you hear any more uh, mature vernacular, I, I, I put a little more mature vernacular into my uh, commentary than the uh, rest of the guys. Just fair warning. Just fair warning. Oh, these fucking guys again. <laughs> I mean, mature is the wrong word. Harsh? No, not harsh. Um, yeah, you're right. Mature is not the right word. Sorry, this is my first stream. I've, 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 I'm bad at commentating. <laughs> I like how I just straight up just steal that joke from Ray, and I have been writing it for a country mile. Add us next time. <laughs> oh, smacking them cheeks. Thank you. Moonlit maple slaps you five bits to woo. Woo, buddy. Checks. <laughs> oh, boy. Freaking, freaking Texas speech can't read for shit. All right, we got some enemies to fight here. Oh, to be fair, I do like chicken, too. I love, since grilled chicken is so cheap and I have, yeah, I, and I have to do adult billing and food bills and money handling and all that. Gr uh, grilled chicken, after I learned how to cook better during COVID, coming into my life was fantastic. Because I love making grilled sandwiches. They're cheap and easy to make. So yes, I would... You know what? Can we just be sponsored by chicken? Can I just be sponsored by chicken? Any chicken companies want to reach out to me? Purdue? I'm down. Tyson? You, you good? <laughs> oh, lord. I want a grilled chicken. I know, right? They're so, they're, they're so quick and easy to make. Just slap some cheese on it. Put your sauce of choice on it. Oh, another Zodiac cape. Those are good. Oh, wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. But she's the only one that can... Oh, no. You can wear it, too. Oh, but it low but no, no, that lowers your defense. That's not worth it. Oh, it's a female-only armor. Oh, I see. Oh, but that lowers your speed, though. Oh, that's close. That's close. That's close. That's close. Alrighty, alrighty. I don't know what this line of snakes is doing. Oh, that's what they're doing. I didn't think I was gonna get through that hitbox properly, but I mean, hey. Get sponsored by actual chicken. <laughs> Word. Word. Whew. Oh boy, here we go again. These annoying monsters. Whatever. I have to admit, I'm slightly disappointed at this game for padding this out this long. Because I, because in this game, in order to get the proper ending, you have to do this three times over. So I'm a, I'm kind of a little disappointed the game padded out that long, but it's okay. So from my experience playing this game, I see why it's a classically uh, lauded uh, JRPG. And this is coming from a guy who loves JRPG. JRPG is my favorite video game genre. Can't imagine if anyone wants to have me on their show to talk about it by any chance. You're gonna grab some grub? Nice. Did you order something, King? All they ask you in return is your eternal devotion to your firstborn. That's gonna be hard to do, considering I'm, as an adult, I'm probably not planning to have kids in my life. So they can have the rights to not have a firstborn then. I guess I can trade him that. Wendy's left over earlier, so technically, yes, technically, no, I gotcha. That's a nice technically. <laughs> All right, so you're on that, you're pretty much on that train too, yeah. So just to put in perspective, I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a 30 year old man, about to be 31, can't believe it. <laughs> and I just realized halfway through my life that kids are just not for me. So here I am. <laughs> big, big, big adult man game player extraordinaire just living life and playing video games. That's pretty much the moral of the stream. Fair enough. Yeah, no, big 30 energy because Shad's a little older than me. He's like 32, if I remember correctly. Shell's 36. 
No, I lied. 35. He's going to be 36, lest I remind him. <laughs> oh man, look 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 at look at us look at us nerd video game players now. We're just having the time of our lives. Oy. Okay, let's um so just put in perspective for this game, I'm doing a no item challenge, which is something I like to do in JRPGs, to really test the full capabilities of its combat system because to put because I'm gonna I'm gonna probably go on a, a, a tangent about this during something I'm gonna be doing in the future JRPGs always have an ebb and flow to them regarding their numbers their combat mechanics and the way they do calculations at least the good ones are and most of them are good so so I just like to I just like to do self-imposed challenges in JRPGs even if I'm playing it blind for the first time oh my god So this battle is essentially pointless. These enemies pretty much lock out your entire commands on your list. So you can only kill them by attacks, but they have high evasion. But they there are no there are no menace to you, so it's basically just kill as much as you can for a good amount of EXP and then and then Oh I lie, they do do damage to you. I get apparently the main eye does. Either way, that wasn't super bad. But then, and then they just run away from battle, so it's one of those- the Other JRPGs have done this too, have a rare enemy that's hard to kill for a lot of EXP. Lost Odyssey has done that, Legendary Dragoon does that. I mean, look at me, I'm sort of, I'm sort of giving spoilers for the tangents I'm gonna be going on. <laughs> Poke them in the eye. Well, good thing the main character, which by the way, this art is done by Akira Toriyama. As a big Dragon Ball fan, I'm surprised I haven't really played this game in my life until now. I have goodbye, enemies. Peace out. Deuces. Thanks for the 500 EXP, that's not a lot. But yes. Good thing the main character uses a katana. He is essentially trunks with sword. Alright, so moving on, moving on. Oh, I don't know what's gonna be next. What's the next room entail? Oh no, probably more battles. A power crest. Trunks has a sword? He does. Trunks has a sword, though. I, well, I said he's like Trunks with sword, so yes. I... All right, listen. I call him Trunks and Trunks with sword because that's how the official DBZ games separate his character if he's in the same game like that. There's Trunks and then Trunks with sword. That's how Tenkaichi did it. <laughs> they are two separate characters. It is like good Cole and evil Cole from PlayStation All-Stars, <laughs> funnily enough. Wow, that is a strong... Whoa. Whoa. I can't tell if that's better or just greatly boost damage. Hmm. Alright, here we go again. Tenkaichi did tear just like it's so wrong. They did it funny. Wrong is... They did it... <laughs> yeah, he has trunks with sword as their birth certificate. Exactly. 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 <laughs> Okay, these guys annoyingly suck MP, so this is gonna be hard for my no item challenge. Josuke four, Josuke eight. Oh, you're you're making you. Uh, oh, it's because of my avatar. You're making a JoJo reference, but admittingly, I'm not that far in the series. <laughs> and unless that's how like the JoJo fighting games do it, that's pretty funny if they do. It's like Fighter Z with different words of Goku. It kinda is. Oh, and, and crazy chick Chimkin lady. I can't pronounce that M properly. That's a tongue twister for me. Thank you for following. Fellow chicken lover. I just realized one of my party members is dead. I'm not looking at the screen. Uh, it's okay. It's whatever. She didn't get the XP, but it's fine. It's whatever. I'm not gonna lose sleep over it. She was, yeah, she, she was just taking a nap. She was just resting her eyes. It's so that's such a dad line, resting your eyes. <laughs> oh no, I wasn't asleep, son. I was just uh, resting my eyes. <sighs> uh. Yeah, that's how our store battle and eyes of heaven differentiate between them. That's pretty funny. Yes, frog, a interesting character. 
So Matt, interested in that indie presentation tomorrow? I'm gonna be honest. Oh no, that's th that middle enemy is a big trouble. That enemy, that middle enemy is big trouble. I didn't even realize there was an indie presentation tomorrow. So is that? You know what? I'm really interested in that new JoJo game they're like localizing, or they're remaking slash localizing. But I know I'm not gonna get any reference in it like past part three. I mean, I know a little about Diamond is Unbreakable, but I'm not, like, I haven't watched it. I just know a little about it. Basically through memes and some non-spoilery stuff. I know, I, I really enjoyed Frog as a character. So anyway, Gilligan, to go back to your statement, I actually didn't realize there was a fucking indie presentation tomorrow. Uh, I'll be busy with work or whatever. I'll, I'll watch it when I can. Who knows? Maybe they'll announce Swap at Showdown, the Pokemon Puzzle League game, the Pokemon Puzzle League inspired game. I I, I really want to see. All Star Battle R, yeah, yeah, that's the new one they're like remaking and giving us to American audiences, right? Or did we already have it at one point? I I don't know. Well, they're dubbing it at the very least. Again, as as, as cringe as cringe as different opinions may be, I actually love dubbing. <laughs> I think I'm nearing the end of this goddamn room. But yes, oh, they just announced it today. I didn't hear about that. I was too busy molding over the fact. We had it, but it's getting remade. Oh, okay, gotcha. I was too busy molding over the fact, like my stream title says, I can't believe I Apple's getting rid of the iPod Touch. I, I still, again, I, I that, that's, that's the joke of this stream title tonight. I can't believe they're doing that. Like, I know... Everyone who's an Apple customer probably just uses an, I, an iPod, uh, iPhone for all their Apple needs, but I'm an Android user. I don't want to buy a whole ass iPhone just to use my iTunes now. That's ridiculous. The iPod Touch was a perfect device for people who want the use of Apple Music and iTunes without having to be an Apple, like, like full-on customer, like with the phone. <laughs> Eat Apple. Recover 5 HP in Paper Mario. Or bake it into a pie. That's a one-shot? When is that one-shot? I don't want to use the MP to revive her. Or, no, maybe I do. Oh, they counterattack. Okay, that enemy apparently nanes on you if you're not careful. I got lucky. We had it and they aren't dubbing. Oh, they aren't dubbing it? Oh. Oh, what a scam. What a scam. All right, well. Oh. <laughs> Dang, <laughs> got my hopes up. I mean, I'll, I'll still consider getting it, but okay, well. <laughs> New characters, too. Okay, gotcha. Eat apple. Yep, recover. Again, since Shell was just streaming Paper Mario recently, recover 5 HP or bake it into a pie. Because it covers parts that haven't really been animated, so they can't really decide to catch anything. Oh, it does. Oh, I, I thought since we had Stone Ocean dubbed by now, I thought we would have had enough voice actors to cover the entire game. That is true. Although, wait a minute. JoJo's a little pansy then, because the Naruto games dubbed the new characters over, which they didn't, I guess they didn't decide on like voice cast yet, but the, the Naruto games dubbed like Madara way before he was English dubbed in the anime. They got his voice actor in advance, but they, wow, J man, Jojo taking L's, man. <laughs> Caramel apple pie. Mm. Not my favorite flavor. My favorite flavor is peach pie, but any, any pie is mostly good. Mm. <laughs> so how about that Overwatch 2, huh? Well, I mean, yeah, it's Overwatch 2. I haven't played Overwatch in forever due to a, a number of reasons. I'm, I'm, I'm curious what guide you're using to tell you all the omens are required. Well, I, 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 the guide says, well, I mean, the Nintendo hotline says I have to do 1,600 and, like, 12,000 for, like, the normal, like, best ending. Like, the normal version of the best ending or something. Is that lay wrong? Hello, Savior, it's good to see you, too. Just act natural. I, 
I haven't heard of that game. Is that like a chat-based like multiplayer game or something? It's good to see you, buddy. Let me just make sure I didn't miss anything above chat. Uh, Jotaro's voice is one of the few that say the same. Ah, I see. No, you don't. Doing them all or just 1000 AD will give you the same ending. Really? Oh, okay. All right, well, hold on. Okay, maybe the guide's wrong. Oh, God. Okay, good. No, no, I'm not showing my screen. Thank God. All right, hold on. Let me let me go back to it. Let me go back to Nintendo Hotline. One sec. It says... Oh, okay. Re uh, really? Okay. No, apparently I could have just beaten it in 1200 BC to continue the story. Okay, hold on. Hold on, hold on. I'm, I'm cheating, but don't mind me. I haven't been looking at a guide this entire playthrough. I just started with the optional side quests and the... Uh... Oh, let's see here. Okay, maybe, maybe, maybe I really can't read. I guess, I guess I misread. The guy's not even saying that now. Okay. All right, fine, whatever. I guess we beat it then. Well, no, we beat 1200, 12,000 BC. Fuck. Whatever. I need the extra experience anyway if I want to beat the bonus boss and all that. Oh, you know this game. Uh, uh, how do I pronounce your name? Xiddle? Ah, oh, you know this game. Okay. It's only worth it if you plan on doing New Game Plus. I'll have a save file set up before I finish this game if I want to do the other zeals then. Or black omens, what do you call them? I gotta go to work, but have a good... You, no problem, dude. You take it easy, homie. Okay. I I guess I understand. I, what, I, I'm so molding, I didn't even notice the item I picked up. Well, while I'm here in the menu... I mean, we can all increase our speed. We all, we all get one free speed. Mom, <laughs> Mom gets us all speed capsules. Yummy. What do I want to do for magic? Got to get speed is important. Matt, the stream. Oh, my bad. I did forget the stream. Thank you. It's okay. You didn't miss much, apparently. Oh, it's these fuckers. I didn't want to get caught by these fuckers. Oh, wait. Fuck. Ayla's bad at avoiding that, whatever it is. I guess she's still standing because the second hasn't passed. Oh, wow. This is really bad. Uh, I'm guessing I have to kill him with magic then. That kind of sucks. Does this count as a dinosaur? Alright, fine. Whatever. We'll just lightning him to death. Yeah, you can beat the boss of the Omen in 1000 AD and repeat all boss are included. I see. Is Ayla wearing the scam accessory? Uh, no. Her accessory is... Her accessory is... Well, her actual accessory is... My friends are, like, that was apparently not a status sale that they hit me with. But no, she's wearing prism spectacles. Because Chrono and... Well, Chrono and Marley have the... Uh, the Savior MP studs, which are very useful. I mean, I'm, I'm definitely happy to rely on them. I wouldn't be able to do this no item challenge without them. When they don't count as using an item, it's just I have weird. Again, it's the whole Black Onyx sort of thing. <laughs> Kill him with give him a brownie and befriend him. Now, what kind of brownie are we talking about here? Maybe get my drift. All right, so I guess I read the guide slightly wrong. Also, you can see my cursor. I'm unprofessional streamer, by the way. All right, cool. So, whatever. Oh, yeah, at least I got extra levels. Again, I probably need the extra levels for the bonus boss. All right, here we go. Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> the good brownies. <laughs> All right, we have a big scary enemy. Okay, he's apparently very magical based, or I have to kill his legs first with that kind of damage. He also counters, that sucks. I mean, hey, it's old SNES. It's old SNES. Well, I mean, they could have redone in Steam, but I mean, like, whatever. I guess I'll try Lightning, too. I'm not super thrilled. No, it didn't hinder it. I won't super hold it against the game. Oh, he's sucking MP. Fuck. That's the last thing I need from Krona. Fuck. <laughs> yeah, this man, this game really likes its tongue attacks. Oh, now he's Roomba in me. Great. Oh, okay. Relax. I, well, I guess I maybe shouldn't have done that. Chrono can't really heal properly. Oh, that's not a. Oh, a Chrono can't. Well, Marley can revive. That's fine. Okay, fuck. Oh, well, that's... Damn, Mail is dead. It's fine, it's fine. I guess I'll use lightning, I guess. Don't put me to sleep. You know, his chat was making the same jokes earlier. Oh, yeah, yeah. All right, a reset. Let's go. I know, she's had a long adventure. Oh, this is a pain in the dick. I know, right? So that room move just takes you down to 1 HP. I guess. I understand. That's annoying. I guess maybe I shouldn't do their move then. Maybe I should have done Aura World. There's a lot going through my mind at the moment. Maybe I should have done Aura World. Uh, that did zero because he has no MP to steal. That's not Ayla dead. Yay. I need to hurry up and kiss like now. Never mind. Okay, that is Ayla dead. Fuck ATB menuing, man. No, I'm kidding. You, you, boy, Vespi's probably gonna pop his rocks off, but what if I switch Luke into the party for this? This is a purely magical-based enemy. What if? What if? I have to be careful. I'm playing with fire. Well, funnily enough, I'm not. But if 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 Marley goes down, it's all over. Oh, fuck. I know. I know, Vespi. I know, man. <laughs> oh, here's the Roomba again. Oh, that sinky gas does fucking damage? Fuck. I'm tired of all the fucking gas in this game. Hmm. Oi. This is rough because Chrono is useless now with his MP. Please tell me that's not a lot. Okay. Oh, you know, okay, so, okay, we're not, it's not over yet, but boy, this is rough. Alright, we're gonna do Ice 2, baby. Even then, he counters with fucking MP suckage, so fuck. Now what? 
I die with... I die, actually. Oh, that's game. Well, that's game for him. It's pretty much game. Okay, that sucks. All right, fair enough. You win game. Man, Magus and Luca actually being useful. Thank goodness. I mean, I guess thank God for the auto saves. I don't remember what the last real save was. At least this game, it doesn't end the moment the protagonist dies. I know, and he even does so canonically. Go fucking figure. Okay. Uh, where did I leave off autosave-wise? Yeah, okay, it is, it is the same thing, okay. Oh, fuck, man. You, you... This party has no healing, though. Stamina, strength, magic crest, magic defense. Fuck Scala's amulet. <sighs> Speedbell looking mighty fine, to be honest. There is frog. Every party should have a cleric. I do like using the healer in my JRPGs. Which I am. That that's that's Marl's role. Yeah, I mean I guess maybe Chrono can take a breather. I mean I guess that's possible, yeah. Man, taking the main character out of a party is I, I know it seems a little weird, but I'm actually gonna lower her magic and raise her attack. Just no no, she she doesn't want a normal attack. What am I saying? Sorry, I'm Oh boy, taking the main character out of the fucking party. I have to admit, that is new ground for me. That is something you never do in JRPGs. That's entirely new. To be fair, this is brought upon me, though, by using no items. But again, this is the no item run experience, so... I never even had to do that much in no item run, probably if ever. That's so crazy, man. Oh, man. You know, I don't want Marley to attack, actually. Nah, fuck the Hayso. I don't need it. I probably should, if, if, if it maybe comes down to it, maybe I have to use the studs. It, because he sucks a lot of MP. I, pro I, I probably have to use the studs eventually. I probably should equip him with the studs so they don't spend as much MP on their moves. Ah, oh, fuck. So unless forced, you keep the main character. Yeah, usually. I mean, by laws of JRPG, he's usually the most busted party member. <laughs> I know, right? I can hang up on my anime figurines. Especially the ones I'm gonna buy of Love Live and Atsuni Miku doing a crossover. Oh, wow. A lot of love tonight. Oh, I just realized my party member is dying. Ouch, big owies. Tarvi, you were playing uh, uh, Paradise Strangers, right? Strangers in Paradise, whatever it's called. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Good to see you, buddy. You caught me playing an ye old JRPG. I well, again, I'm playing this blind for the first time, and I know I'm near the end of the game. I I do acknowledge that this game was quite the adventure. Thank you so much for the raid. Kill chaos. <laughs> yep, you're. I guess you're repping the good emo and all that.
Yes, it is my first time. Which is unique because I'm a Chrono Cross fan. I'm actually going back and playing the prequel first. I was actually a Chrono Cross fan for about 20 years, and I've never played the original. I've given it an attempt before on emulator, but in 2007 I couldn't get into it for some reason or another. I guess I wasn't the right mood. Your physical copy of Cross nice, dude. Oh, not the Roomba move, fuck. I just used Cure on fucking Luca, fuck. Oh, he has no more. Fuck, Marley's gonna die. Okay, well, that actually goes against my fucking plan. This guy times attacks like a bitch. Uh, and then Luca's gonna only have, like, two more attacks. The added stuff isn't great. I've heard mixed things about it, too. But the added stuff is canon that leads into Cross, so I wanna... I wanna experience that, too. The big dude that makes vacuum noise, I know, right? I mean, he's a Roomba, dude! He fucking sucks over you with the bottom part. Oh, my lord. But his top is still... Okay, so here's the problem. Here's the unfortunately ultimate problem. Well, I'm pretty much out of MP and I'm not using items, so... Look at you're sleeping poisoned. Wait, that's not... That, you can't have two status ailments. That's cheating. No, I'm kidding. The gate guardian... I know, right? Where's my black skull dragon? Now, see, a Yu-Gi-Oh! reference isn't lost on me. Nice reference there. Alright, so, bad news. Well, good news, we got farther in the boss battle. Bad news is we're probably still gonna lose. Fuck. <sighs> He's out getting grocery. He's picking up chicken. He wants to make grilled chicken sandwiches for the week. Oh, this blows... Ah, uh, wait, flamethrower only costs one, right? I... It's gonna be very close, Vespi. Oh, this is gonna be so close. It is! Well, yes, because this art style was Akira Toriyama, and I don't really know the artist of Cross, to be honest, but yes, the characters are different, per se. I'll tough it out. I won't give up, but I'll tough it out. Luca's about to go down. She doesn't get another turn. She does get another turn. Cool. Alright, bye, Luca. Oh! Oh, no, that's light. Oh, uh, so this is where I've come in my no-item challenge, huh? Alright, so there are ways to- is, so assuming I lose, there are ways to strategize around this. Obviously, I can equip a stud to one of the mages. I can't let Marley die so easily, that was a misplay on my part. I can't let Marley die so easily, that was a misplay on my part, because she- I can't believe I fucking won. I can't fucking believe it. Fuck. <sighs> Life is pain! That's not the character I want to heal. What am I doing? Get this person out of here. <laughs> Yeah, I know, you just swing for the fences, I know. I, it's been a while since I had to swing for the fences in something. I think it's not since I played Xenogears I had to swing for a fence regarding a roll. 
Oh boy, that really gets your Jolly Rogers. Well, you brought your your, your 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 balls. I'm I'm trying to make a more G-rated version of getting your balls going, but you know what I mean. I fucking can't speak, and I sound like a fucking pirate knockoff. Great. This is a fucking disaster, man. <laughs> I know, right? I warmed up to his. I mean, I didn't hate him at first, but I'm experiencing so many new characters for the first time. Some admittingly more important than others in the sequel to this game, but it's nice that I'm learning a, a lot about them. Not a no item, no death. Alley. No, it's not no death. I can't pull that many miracles. Whew. Especially, I mean, if I wasn't blind at this, I could probably plan a little better, but. Oi. Okay, great. Let's go into the scary teleporter. What, the good old-fashioned 16-bit music makes you happy? Please, not another elevator sequence, please. I can't, I can't take it, man. Please, no, please. Oh, I, I, I can't, man. No, not these. I mean, I'm fine against these fuckos. I resist their status. Well, that's telling. Music from this game makes you happy? I mean, to be fair, it's a bopping soundtrack. I have m slightly mixed opinions about the battle theme, but this main one. But I lean towards more liking it. I like the slap and bass one. It is a little too simplistic of a song, though. I do agree with some of that criticism, but it's still fine. It's still fine, the normal battle theme. I've heard worse. Way worse. But yeah, so a lot of this music is great. Frog's theme was triumphant, and I was listening to it today because it helped me through my day of sadness of Fall Guys removing the team-based games and the iPod Touch dying. And you guys are here, too. Cross's battle theme is brutal. You know, I don't hate it as much as everyone else does. I don't act fuck off. I don't hate it as much as everyone else does, to be honest. There, there is overleveling, but that removes all the challenge. I mean, yeah, but it's like the iPod Touch is dead. Yeah, you didn't hear the news. Apple is discontinuing. I'm gonna move my webcam down there. My webcam's a little displaced. I don't think I was molding or anything. I thought it already died. That's what everyone said. No, it didn't die. They haven't released a new one since 2019, May 2019. But no, it was still alive for a while. Again, I think it's great as a device because I'm not an Apple customer. I use Android a lot, but I still use iTunes in my life building up a library. So, of course, I use one Apple device to listen to it. It's pr it's, it, it's kind of sort of its only job. And, but my battery, so here's where I'm really in despair. My, bat the, my, my iPod Touch is like six and a half years old. My battery blew up to kingdom come because fuck Apple. And... Oh god, it's big chungos again. And I was literally on the cusp of buying a new iPod Touch. But I'm like, well, now it's not going to be supported anymore, so now I'm just, am I buying, I'm already buying an outdated device? I mean, it can still do the stuff I want it to do. I'm not going to be, like, using it for huge apps or anything. It's fine. But it's like, it, fuck. It's like, damn. Hmm, 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 hmm. Again, the slap and bass line really saves this song, that's for sure. Bum bada bum 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 bada bum 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 bum. Why didn't Scott Pilgrim play this bass line against uh, Todd in, in, in Scott Pilgrim? He had to play FF6, didn't he? Oh, hello, Monsieur Sonic. You love the battle music in Crunk? There, there we go. It's nice to it's nice to really converse with someone who does love it, too. Again, I see why people don't like it. It does sound maybe a little weird sometimes. And people say it sounds like a goddamn clown fiesta. <laughs> I mean, it sort of does with some of the violins and one of the horns they use in the song. It does have an, a, a, a rhythmic melody, too. If I'm really using my music-inclined words properly. I apparently can't menu properly either and talk at the same time. So I see why people don't like it, but I guess the ones who do really find the gold in it. It just sounds like it's made to be annoying. 
Again, I understand. I understand that complaint. I'm, but I think it sounds a little more mysterious than an. Oh fuck off! Than annoying. Oh oh no, these aren't. Oh no. Yeah, these guys physical attack you back. Yeah, it's fine. Ow, that really hurt, by the way. Apparently, the Switch is about to outsell the Game Boy. The original. Cool. That's pretty dope. It just because the rest of the OST, the rest of the Chrono Cross's OST is absolutely godly. Everyone can agree on that. People Imprisoned by Destiny is one of my all-time favorite tracks. I still remember hearing that track nearly 20 years ago. I'm like, oh my god. I'm how well, I wasn't 12 per se, but I was like, I was like, I'm 11 and this is deep. I was like nearly 20. It was like nearly 20 years ago. I played Chrono Cross when I was around like 13, 14. God, People Imprisoned by Destiny. For those who don't know, that's uh, Dario's battle theme. There people I'm just saying for the Chrono Cross fans who don't remember. That's a great song. That song, that song makes me feel things. You you were a senior in high school when you played it. Oh, look at me, I'm ZY. I'm older than that big fan. <laughs> you know of RGT85, right? Yeah, I some I sometimes see <laughs> excuse me, I'm sorry. I sometimes see his YouTube videos suggested to me. And I see him on Twitter every now and then and like suggest it. I can't believe I went up that way. Oh, we're fighting the walls again? Great. It has 107 million installed. That is about to outsell the Game Boy. Which my family did have. We did have the original Black and White Game Boy. To put age in perspective, since I, I'm nearly 31, so I was born in 91. And my older sister, who is around eight uh, to not eight, well, nine or ten years old, I mean, depending on the time of the year. Was into video games also, so she had an original NES and black and white Game Boy. So I grew up playing those games. That's why Super Mario Bros. 3 is one of my favorite games of all time. I was lucky enough to have those consoles even when I was young enough to commonly understand how to play video games. You had one, I'm 23. That is, uh, Jay. And there we go. You got an OG black and white Game Boy? That's actually decently impressive. You had two! Both hand-me-downs, I see. So it was like an older sibling, I'm guessing. Dope. <gasps> oh, God, a save point. Oh, Neptune's Preserver. An 18-year age of... Ah, I see. That is quite intriguing. So he's celebrating because the game didn't... Well, well, well I'm sorry, what? He, he's celebrating because the game didn't sell 3 million from the latest report. And he made a bet with Spawnway that if the game sold 3 million, he wouldn't have to play Bell and Wonder. What game are we talking about? Oh, you're talking about the Switch itself. Oh, I, okay. You're talking about the Switch itself. Oh, okay. Oh, you're talking about Metroid Dread? Oh. I was gonna say, no, wait, you can't talk about the Switch itself. I'm doing the numbers wrong. Sorry, I can't, I can't bring. I'm already molding at this game tonight. I can't bring. That's you said one, you didn't say a hundred. You said just one million. Oh. So are they betting over Metroid Dread? Is he being an asshole about it or something? Wouldn't shock me coming from Nintendo fans. I know I sound a little, uh... Oh, more speed. The Game Boy family as a whole was... Really? That, that, you mean that includes the color? Not the Advance, though. The Advance would definitely pump it over those numbers. Yeah, not GBA. Yeah, yeah, there's no way. That, that's just Game Boy and Game Boy Color. I did have a Game Boy Color. It was yellow. I know, right? You're saying, whoa, the blue guy had a yellow Game Boy? 
I'm like, actually, yeah, yellow's my third favorite color. Uh, the GB Pog and the GB Light. I forgot about those other two, to be honest. I'm sick and tired of this room? Oh, no. Okay, fine. Is, is he is he not magical based? Can I just be oh, I can't beat him to a pulp. No. Alright, maybe his Roomba is more vulnerable to physical. Please, can I beat him to a pulp? Do I have to use magic? No, man. Life Shaver? That's the name of a goddamn Yu-Gi-Oh card. I know we're playing Yu-Gi-Oh. This sucks. Oh, it's magic again. Fuck. Oh, I I man, I I can't go on. You got a base GBA from a resale shop? Nice. Yeah, I... Yeah, I know. He's kind of an asshole. Oh, he, he absorbs ice? What does this guy do? Do I have to aim for his top first or something? Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm not gonna win this attempt. I'll tell you that right now. Or maybe I can. Oh, Ayla's use. Okay, you know what? I'm sorry, ZY. Ayla's taking some L's. She's not really good against these bosses. I have to remember, even some of her non elemental skills don't do any sort of elemental damage. Uh, I will give up this attempt. The Switch effect won't even push it? Eh, no, Nintendo fans, man. They say they Nintendo fans say the darnest things. There's a fast way and a slow way. All right, I'll try and figure it out. I wonder if it has to do with a certain element he absorbs, because he absor his Roomba absorbed ice. Oh, hey, by the way, hey, Asher, I'm sorry I didn't greet you. I I I thought your name was another name member in chat. Admittingly, sorry, Asher Ninja. <laughs> Good to see you. Oh, did he have a hard time finding the hidden ceiling? That's hilarious. That's hilarious. If he really did, that would be great. I never liked that guy to begin with. His face is ugly on his thumbnails. Oh, okay. Oh, I, I would love it if he did. Yeah. <laughs> My bad, because Crazy Chicken Lady was here earlier, too. I thought it was, and you guys used the same purple. I, I know I really should try and read better. I can't read, though. And I shouldn't just try and just see who's typing in chat from the color of their name. But, hey, <laughs> whoopsie. Oh, I have to do this again. Yeah, I can't read. Dread Soul 2.9 million copies. Okay, so yeah. So by the next report, it's definitely going to sell 3 million. There's no way it doesn't. So what is so what is he mad? So again, I'm I'm trying to follow the story as best as possible from all the other chat members, but um, so what is he? So is he mad or happy? I can't tell. He's probably mad. He's one of those Nintendo fans. This party can do the slow way. Well, I'm not gonna have Ayla in here. That's for sure. Matt is purple colorblind confirmed. Actually, funny enough, I did know someone who was maroon colorblind. He couldn't see dark maroon. Which is very close to Godot, I know. Or what, he's reversing his stance saying he's right about the switch effect, so he's just trying to play both sides of the field. I'm like, yeah, it's not surprising, it's... He's, he just has, has that kind of personality. It's whatever. It's okay. Hey, look, Ayla kind of deserves it. The game was jacking her off the entire time. So she kind of deserves it. I'm actually really happy the game sort of balances out a little. But fuck me. I don't have, I barely have enough magic to take this guy out. Oh, 
Oh, he's not? Oh, okay. He's not playing both sides? I'm, whatever. I, I mean, I can't... Then, can you describe to me just in a more brief nutshell than what's going on? I, I admit, I lost track of the conversation, Gillian. I, I admit. I can't, I can't tell whether he's happy or not. You can explain to me like I'm five. I won't take offense. Oh, you played this game before, Astro? Nice. Okay. You know what? I think I saved after I beat the walls. I, sh I should probably just load the save. Okay. Oh, fuck it, frog. Oh. See, the only thing I'm having trouble following in this conversation, Gilgan, is he on Metroid Dread's side or not? I can't tell. That's the, one, that's the one thing that's confusing me about this conversation. I can't tell if he's on Metroid Dread's side or not. Because you said he calls it niche and underwhelming or whatever. So I thought he was against Dread, but now he's happy for Dread? I'm confused. Try, uh, uh, But I do ask, please try and do it very briefly. I can't read tonight. You played it uh, when you were 12 on PS1. Nice. You wouldn't believe the first time I played this game. <laughs> I guess I will try with this party. He's all magical based. Fuck, man. He, he does he suck magic? I was missing that fact. <laughs> oi, oi, Malloy. I probably well, no. I I have the studs on Chrono and Dela. Oh, he heals down there. Okay, um, we're gonna... I'm gonna do... Oh, he sucks himself off! Oh, okay. I understand, I understand, I understand, I understand. You don't attack his Roomba. You need single elements. Fuck. He sucks off his Roomba and recovers that way. I understand. I mostly was just confused, except for Frog. He loves Metroid Dread, but believes the game warrants of the highest-selling game, which, which he has proven wrong. Yeah, he is. That... Okay, he, suck, he sucks HP. He doesn't suck MP, thank God. I, this is the slow way. I'm guessing just figuring this out and, and doing the slow way is this way. I wonder what the fast way is. No, it isn't? Oh. Am I actually smart, Vespi? I could, I could really use a wish right now to tell me I'm smart. You want me to tell you? Oh. That was a lot of suckage. Wait a minute, no, no, something's still wrong here. I'm not out of the clear, actually. He just fully, well, not fully healed himself. He hella healed himself. In the bed he made with Spawn, he said that the game didn't sell past uh, free poppy and metro for IC. That's not fair, he gets to suck from his Roomba, even though I'm not attacking it anymore. <sighs> do you... Do you... You must... Do you light the Roomba on fire? I'm all out of fire, though. Unless I, unless I really break the creed and use items. I mean, I don't... I mean, real talk. I don't have to use items. I could just walk all the way out. I, I could walk all the way out. I'm off base, okay. Hmm.
I'm off base, huh? Yeah, I'm missing one key detail I don't know about. Okay. I will try and rack my brain. But his counter believes that Nintendo will never bring up Dread Sales Report in the future report after this report. I mean... So he's, so he's playing Phoenix right with it. Unless he has actual definitive proof about VG sales, he won't accept that it sells over 3 million. Well, maybe Nintendo will just shut him up and actually just reveal more Dread Sales after this. That would be pretty funny. I mean, you can be very pedantic about that and say, nah, Dread didn't sell over 3 million. We don't have official proof, but I mean, that's ridiculous if it's at 2.9. That's r Okay, I understand the situation now. Thank you. I can read. Again. The best game of all time? It's... Oh, I mean, I'm enjoying it. I'm enjoying it. It's all right. Oh, uh, this half isn't working. I'm missing one key detail I don't know about. Does it have to do with an element? A roundabout way of saying no. You don't put words in my mouth. Fuck. I, you know, real talk, I was just lazy and just jumped in the battle. I should, I should have Frog. I should have Frog equipped with a fucking uh, helm of non statuses. I'm guessing the fast way saves a bunch of. Oh, God. Saves a bunch of MP also, but it just. I do want to play this blind. I do want to play this blind. Man, that Roomba suckage is annoying. Do I have to do I have to use a status on him? Oh no. Oh, that's bad frog. That's that that ain't that ain't Gucci. No! That's game. Oh boy. That's borderline game. And now he's sucking himself off again. Yeah, okay. Fuck, okay. A game is flopping? Matt, wait, what is it? Oh yeah, people say whatever the fuck they want. They don't know what they're talking about. Let me just tell you, okay, fine. Oh, he sucks too much of himself off. Oh. I see. Okay. Oh, so if I played my cards right... I, I understand. So basically, if I play my cards right, I don't have to use any MP against him. Oh, um, wait, actually, no, I want to test something out since I have a reset save going on. One sec. Does he life shaper when you attack the upper part? He doesn't. Or does he counter with Terra Mutant? I can't tell. No, I think you have to attack him with an element to get his AI to suck himself off. Like, if he could just pretend to suck himself off while us doing the light damage on the top, that'd be great. I'm trying to spend as least MP as possible. No, he will do it. He will do it. Okay. That's really it? Okay. All right. I'll, I'll, I'll take a slice of that action then. I really do. I mean, fuck, man. Fuck, I have to make Chrono Trigger's making me sweat a little. I can't believe I'm saying those words. Fuck.
Oh. Because there has to be one point I can fully heal. There, there's I, and the thing that stressed me out is, and you don't have to tell me, I don't know if there's a place to fully heal without going back through the entire dungeon. And that's actually just CBT. Respectful CBT, but it's CBT. Luminaire can kill him in one turn. Was he shadow based then? It's still a baby game, Matt. Up until around now, I have to admit, it's making me sweat a little. Fuck. I mean, I know, you said the top only has 8,000 HP. I read the whole sentence. I was just wondering if he was shadow-based, that's all. Fuck. <sighs> Luminaire is just broken. <laughs> Oh, you used Marley a lot too? Go, yeah, I don't blame you. She's a cool waifu. Even if she's, she's, not, she's not the best party member. Fuck Ayla, by the way. No, I'm kidding. Oh, fuck. I want to see something. Oh, God. I probably should give Chrono the the, uh, the golden stuff. This one he only has silver, so I can only use Luminaire twice if he really needed to. But whatever, man. Okay, fuck. Put him in the party. All right, it's gonna take a few more Luminaires than that. Otherwise, frog blood, that's fair. Fuck, man. Oh, I never. Yeah, okay, okay. Another big mistake is I didn't equip a helmet onto frog. So now I can't do enough DPS before he sucks himself off. That was my fault. I got impatient again. I didn't equip Frog with the helmet. Ow. Yeah, I can't. Oh, yeah, with, with Frog not with it, I can't out DPS it. All right. No problem, I had to figure this out. Yeah, I can't have DPS it. Especially now with Chrono out of MP. I could tech Water Ice in a little bit. Even though attacks is base too. Mm, that's that's not th them alone do more than combining that together. Again, guys, frog slightly under leveled. I never used him in his stats and all that. Okay, fuck. Fuck. Okay. What do I want to do? What do I want to do? What do I want to do?
Do I want to wait it? Waiting it out is good for my no item run, but uh, do I want to push it a little? Oy. Okay. Do I want to push it a little? Yeah, I just didn't want to. I just didn't want to think about it. But yeah, it is. The slow way is good. It is just better for my no item run. What am I doing? Uh, all right, here we go. Slow gas the boss. Hey, look, Ayla gets screen time. What a fucking surprise. <laughs> it sounds so apathetic. Man, all crits, homies. Let's go. And we're counting it down by the thousands. Not by... <laughs> Essentially. Oh yeah, well, at least he sucked himself a little faster. I'm falling asleep. I should have healed with Ayla, whatever. Imagine if I fall asleep and misplay. You know what? You know what? Since I have the time, I better not overly distract myself so I don't misplay. But uh, you know what? Let's just you know let's just talk turkey, guys. Hey, who 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 you been jacking off to recently? What what anime girl or waifu or bond of your choice? 
Who's, who's, been, who's been on your uh, fab folder list recently? For me, I've, uh, well, I mean, I never lost the love, but as you see with my desktop and everything, I've, uh, I've gotten back into really nutting to Aqua. I gave her some downtime, but I'm back to nutting to Aqua. Senran Kagura, like all the characters or a few in particular, or one? Or is it just because you're playing fucking Bon Appetit? Matoko Kusanagi. Why does it sound familiar? The Major. Oh, okay. You mean Ghost in the Shell, right? I'm not the biggest ghost- you're gonna fucking shoot me in my knee for this one. I'm not the biggest Ghost in the Shell fan, I've only ever seen the live-action movie. Yeah! <laughs> Homura, Asuka, and Katsuragi in particular. Okay, dope. I know you like Homura, she's one of your favorite girls. Asuka's the pretty much main bitch, so you'll see her all over the place. Of all Ghost in the Shell, you really saw that? I had a couple of friends who- Look, it, it was like, in my friend group, it was like- I'm not talking about Pete and- and, uh, Silver and everybody, I'm talking about other people, but in my friend group- I'm gonna do Aura World, so I'm not super distracting myself. Um... In my friend group, one of my older friend groups, there was like, half of us- half of them wanted to see the movie because they are Ghost in the Shell fans, even though they knew it was probably gonna be bad, and half of us weren't, so we just- we just went to support them. We were like, sure, dude, I'm down to watch a movie. Is Carl J Johans gonna wear a skin tight suit or something? Hey, the movie was great. Are you great dead ass? Oh well again, I don't want to put words, I guess, in my own mouth. I thought it was pretty just okay. Because well, because again, the friends who were the fans of Ghost in the Shell were um not happy with it, so. I, I didn't absorb my opinion from them. I, again, I was just pure neutral because I don't know much about Ghost in the Shell, but my, I do remember my friends not liking it. It didn't 100% fit into the identity. Okay. I mean, I, I do, do. Of course, they don't have a good reputation at all. So, yeah, I understand, ZY. <laughs> Oh, but if you look at it more of an outside sci-fi action flick, was it dope? It was pretty cool. I remember the final boss of that movie being, like, the spider robot, and that's just, like, a sort of, like, common robot. They, like, upgraded, like, a common mook from the show to be a final boss, and my friend couldn't believe it. I'm like, oh, okay. Ah, so that is your opinion, too. Ah, isn't it great how we all seen Ghost in the Shell? Isn't it great that that conversation stemmed from asking, off, asking who you've been jacking off to waifu-wise? I said- I, I, I put in my answer. I said Aqua. I've, I've, of course, I've rediscovered the urge for good old Aqua. God, I love that girl. The uh, Konosuba Aqua, not the Kingdom Hearts Aqua. I admittedly don't know much about the Kingdom Hearts Aqua. To be honest, Chrono Trigger loot art isn't, like, fully up to snuff. It suffers from the Phoenix Rider Tails problem, to be honest. There's decent stuff, but it's not, like, blow my rocks off or anything. Again, Aqua overtook distracting me. But the soul of Ghost of Zelda's philosophy with the movie like Tyler. Yeah, that's what my friend was saying, too, I remember. I will do Aura Whirl again, just to make sure I'm topped off. Underrated movie, Valorin in the City of a Thousand Plants. I haven't quite heard of that one. It was missing its ghost. Basically, when I say someone's gonna shoot me in my knee, that obviously means, like, flame shield up. That's like, that's like my, my, uh, hashed line for flame shield up. Because I never know how someone's gonna respond when I know a little about their, or a series they like more than me. And how they respond to me, what, what I little know about it. Like, not, not the fact that I know little about it, but I might have seen, like, <laughs> like something not desirable from the series. Like, a.k.a. a live-action movie. 
That's all. That's just, I mean, that's just my flame shield upline. Chrono suffers because it's a 90s game before Angel was popping. Yeah, that's kind of the case, too. That is also the case. That you are 100% correct on that one. Okay. Great. Maybe, I, I mean, I, again, I don't know much about Ghost of Hell. Maybe I'll rewatch it one day. Ah, see? Great. That's another series I maybe should more, learn a little more about. And again, yeah, I've never seen much Ghost in the Shell. It's probably, it's, it, I, I, I've heard it again. I've heard it's a great anime, but it's, it's not not my cup of tea, but it's not so much that it is my cup of tea that I'm going to propel it to the top of my to watch list because, you know, busy adulting enough as it is. My description was for the vet. Oh. Okay. God, this boss design sucks. But again, at least I have chat to keep me company. And thank you guys. Trust me, I can't thank you guys enough. It's based off a comic series that inspired Star Wars, really. Go figure. So again, sci-fi based. Chrono Cross is supposedly the same world, but the connection isn't that strong, is it? Yes and no. Like, when I would to, to follow up with your line about, is the connection strong? Yes and no, and I can't go into it without spoiling, which I'm going to play Chrono Cross during the summer. And I know that game, like the back of my hand. The answer to that question is yes and no. <laughs> I know, right? How fucking <laughs> cryptic can I be? Yes, <laughs> yeah, exactly. Let's put it this way. At least I can start off by saying it's not exactly the same exact landmass of the world, which... Again, it depends on your interpretation of Chrono Trigger's world. We all, we have a little bit of world map. Is this the entire world, or is this like like a section of the world? Like maybe this is one hemisphere of the world. Because to be honest, the world map in Chrono Trigger isn't that big. It's just repeated six times with different time periods and all that. Oh, like four or five. Like you know what I mean. You know what I mean. And I, I'm not saying that's a fault of the game. The game does that on purpose. But I'm saying, do we acknowledge this as Chrono Trigger's full world, or maybe it's just one hemisphere? The reason why I say that is because Chrono Cross can take place in a different hemisphere, especially since it looks a, a handful different than Chrono Trigger's mainstay world. Maybe because Chrono Cross takes place in a tropical archipelago, so maybe it's just a different hemisphere. And the reason why I say, the re oh, there we go. So I can finally attack with magic, right? Cool. The reason why I say that is because. Oh! Oh, whoa, 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 whoa! Whoa, you didn't tell me he was gonna do this! Whoa, pause the phone for a second. A France exclusive steelbook. I too buy steelbooks of four, well, like stuff that isn't released in America that I like. Of, of stuff that is released in America. Like, I bought steelbooks of Tales games, which are rarely ever released in America. Talk about the maps remind me of picture post of uh, pictures of JRPG and having just just <laughs> the rest of it just water, yeah. So again, if we if we sort of use like maybe a little bit of fan canon that this is one hemisphere and Chrono Cross takes place in the archipelago tropical region of the hemisphere, sure, I'd be down with that. Oh. Wait, what? Oh, okay. Oh, it literally I don't even have to kill its eight thousand, it just dies. Alright, that boss is funny. All right, cool. That boss is funny. It's also... Let me just read Mr. Sonic. It's also one of the few AAA studio movies that was filmed in 3D and not just converted to it. Oh, wow. When was that movie released? Was it was that, like, ahead of its time? Because you said it was based on a 60s comic. It probably wasn't made in the 60s for obvious reasons, but... Was that ahead of its time, or did this, like, release during, like, the 2000s, like, the last couple decades it flew under the radar? Okay, so it flew under the radar five years ago. I see.
Yeah, that's starting to get a little annoying too, but whatever. Uh, by Weta. I haven't heard of Weta per se, but if you say they're good on props and practical effects, I believe you. There's another boss right after this. I mean, I'm saving. Don't don't worry. I'm I'm a JRPG gamer. I'm saving every fucking chance to get. I'm I am in sweat mode. I understand. Okay. Here we go. I am coming up to this despairing knowledge that there is no full heal in this dungeon, is there? It's- don't tell me it's another Roomba. I will shit my pants right on camera. Oh, okay. Fuck. I don't want to use shelters, man. Annihilation zone, huh? I have to steal from this thing, right, Vespi? You advise that? I fucking Xbox controller, man. I fucking hate this, man. Oh, wow. Well, if I Xbox... I have to be very careful. If I, Xbox, if I Xbox controller, I lose. I'm not spending... I'm not spending the MP to revive. Not from an Xbox controller mistake. I will go to PC controls. Or maybe I should start using the pad I was using the stick, but they're both janky as fuck. What made you go guide, Matt? No judge, just curious. I wanted the side quests over with... F oh, well, I mean, if v Vespi's giving me small advice about the boss, because uh, I'm a little tired and molding, that's all. B about using the guide for the side quests, I just wanted those over as f faster than possible. That, that's all. It's more for pacing in my stream content creation, that's all. If I didn't use the guide for the side quest, this, this game would have been two streams longer than it's going to be. As for the rest of you giving boss advice, I do like to do the boss blind first, but if he can offer slight... Again, it is still me doing the action, so... And the room and that room of boss is just arduously designed. They cock and ball torch you on purpose. That to maximize your first pass of carriage, you have to continue being asked to the female lead. You, well, yeah, well, n well, half sort of. Well, you, well, that's, no, well, if you, well, yes, you do, actually. No, no, you're, you're right. I mean, unless the game scams me like Dalton or the one laser robot, it's not the worst. The spin of battles aren't the worst thing in the world, it's just... That's a little strong. We do a little scary there. Alright, well you didn't give it to me that time. What, did I not speak correct English? I probably am, then. There it is. Chrono lives this, right? He does. Yeah, ceiling items is pretty poggies. You're using water surge against Marley, you fool. You haven't learned anything in the years you've been alive. I hate how the cursor resets on the shell. I that must be one of my specific menu options. Fuck. Ceiling on the wayside for say, Yeah, that's true. Sorry, what was I talking about that I had the stroke over? Did, using guides or something? It was like... I know, because I'm being, like, nondescript. It's, it's hard to mention. It's hard to fully describe, to be honest. 
it's like I want to do the boss blind, but then it's like I don't mind if Vespi gives me like a little fight up. Vespi knows the right way to push me in the right direction without just typing out a paragraph out of the boss. Oh, Astro Ninja's on. Oh. Okay, yeah, because I was I was responding to Astro Ninja's. Okay, because I thought he meant something, and then I, he meant something else, and he's right. I, I know I'm be I'm being yesent again. I know. I know I'm being yesent again. Hello? Okay, I was about to say. Yes, in, in, what he's trying to say is, in order to get every party member in the game, which is impossible on one singular playthrough, you have to do two and a half playthroughs, to be honest. Uh, you have to be a di you have to do dialogue options that are a dick to the female lead, that is true. He is right. And yes, I yeah, 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 no, yeah, yeah, no, yeah. Yeah, no, dude. I can't believe I'm only gonna fit well, I mean I I sort of misread and doing one extra of these black omas are necessary. I can't believe the game sort of like can let you do this three times. This is cock and ball torture. Oh lord. But doesn't Lavos cause, like, a lot of status ailments? Isn't protecting and sending ailments good? Isn't that, like, a good thing? I know, this is me. Bosses don't reset, neither do just I see. I don't- I- I- I mean, mm, okay. Because I have to admit, with the sped of battle system, again, from the sped of battle system, speed isn't really an issue, per se. Except for the scam enemies, but it's fine. <laughs> okay, we're fighting the walls again, woohoo. Everything's looking great except for Chrono's MP, which I know I'm blocking, but he has 19. Ayla has 58 and Marley has 68. I know, one short, but they're doing fine, actually. I'm actually getting, and I actually got full party rotation out of my side members, too, for 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 doing for putting in work and doing blows. What, you wanted me to repeat the boss battle and steal two haste helms? I'm good. I'm fine. I'm fine. It's not a big deal. Again, who knows how much... Oh, you mean putting it on... Oh, oh, oh. I mean, I, I... I mean, yes, no, no, yes, no, no, yes, no. I mean, I kind of like having... Did you see the fucking confusion robots on the elevator? And who knows what Lavos causes to you? I kind of like having no status ailments. But more speed means more DPS, and you don't have to use MP to use DPS, too. <sighs> Good job, Chrono. I do like how you fight the doors and the wall in this game. Wait, then how is Chrono blocking? Is that an armor I missed? Oh, He has a... Yes, he has a Nova armor. <sighs> I am really sucking the last of my back appealing, that's for sure. <laughs> I could be a dick right now, but I I won't. I I, <laughs> I could make the shadow the hedgehog a minor spelling mistake. I win, but 
Let me be a little nice. You guys are keeping me company. I don't want to be all alone. All, what, did I miss the save point? Okay, great. I can't even see now. <laughs> whoa, 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 what? Any, any reaction, Chrono? Damn it. <laughs> uh, oh. Hey, Zeal. Nice cock and bull torture dungeon you have here. I really feel, I was really feeling it. Like, damn. You really went all out. You didn't have to, but you really did. My cock and balls are sore up the wazoo. And you just referenced Shadow the Hedgehog, too. I know, right? I know what you've seen. It's the future slumbers that hail the destiny in its essential form. All the dreams that may have been all the happiness and sorrow you might have known. Is she just trying to avoid pain? Is that is that all just what it comes down to? Destiny as let well destiny or fate? Again, there's some minor there's some minor story in That's what I'm looking for, fucking thing. There's some minor story, I guess. I, what's what's the I word that means to infer something? Infer. There's some. There, you can infer some story elements from this game into Cross if you really wanted to. If you really want to stretch your like canon, why am I not moving? Oh. Come, children, the lavos slumbers. The lavos, by the way. Oh fuck. Let me guess, you do something crazy. Oh, he's halation. That's not good. I just attacked with everybody. Uh, maybe I shouldn't rush to press the A button. Fuck. Oh! She didn't take the nine damage. She didn't take the nine damage. She actually got off the second frame. That was a frame one survival. I was about to maul that she died with my slow ass AT being. But she just she, we just cheated! We just cheated! Oh wait, dear, did she suck MP? I I can't tell. That's annoying. It was MP? Okay, we didn't cheat. Oh, uh, we can't do this forever, unfortunately. She only has one move that does normal damage. Okay, I will keep that in mind. Probably has an end boss finisher move, like haha. -ha. Alright, then I won't aura whirl like myself all the way up, but I still gotta be careful with those end boss finisher moves. Maybe she'll burp and fart like Dalton. He started that fucking trend. Aura World is great, just like Chrono's MP is gonna look like dog shit after this, though. Oh no. Oh, now his MP's really gonna look like dog shit, fuck. Actually, I just lost, sort of. I can't- I can't get her up in time enough. Fuck, dude. This blows donkey dick. You know what? Maybe the speed helm would be helpful. Maybe. Can't guarantee it. Yeah, I know, right? There's a love life joke to be made here. I knew that. No way! Okay. That could have gone a little better, but fuck. Ah, oh, I have a better idea. I can feed you to the Mammon Machine. What the fuck is- oh, the Mamry Machine, great. Can I be honest with you, Matt? Yeah, you can be brutally honest. Yeah, 
I knew I was going to be sucked into another thing. This game was rigged from the start. You won't be able to last without items. <laughs> I won't accept that. So do I have to use magic now? I'm down for magic. Let's go. Oh, he uses bide. Fuck. He uses bide. Okay, I see. I mean... <sighs> Point flare, huh? Fine. Is this when the thing happens or did it already happen? You mean when Chrono dies? No, he already died. Nah, he already died. This is like pure, like, almost endgame. Like, pure, pure almost endgame. Oh, oh stop. My cursor was fucked there for a second. He sacrificed magic? That's interesting. Oh, Lord. Fuck. That's fine, that's fine. I thought the stream. I thought the stream where I like went crazy and mistook Bagon for um. Oh, I said it backwards. I I mistook Rampardos for Bagon. Was like bad, but oh boy. I have out cock and ball torture myself. All right, so listen. Here's why I'm silent. I'm really just going through all my options here. Listen, if this game is as cock and ball, don't you mean Cranios? I do mean Cranios. See, I can't even word right. So I'm going through all my options here. If I lose this, it's there's nothing. I mean, there is, but. No, I don't want to know. If... If I really can't beat this, I can leave. It's not the best thing ever, but I can leave. It'll it'll be cock and ball torture take forever, and I can't do it tonight, but I can leave. I can no item run this game. It is possible. It's, you look hella interesting. Hello, Zeal. You maggots. Oof, I see. Man is huffing that copium. I am huffing copium. It's, I mean, it's technically not over. I can run back and heal. And this is cock and ball torture, and the stream pacing is in shambles. But I will go no itemless. I, I will not live with this for the rest of my life.
Oh, fuck. You look interesting. Yeah! <laughs> fuck, man, I guess the Super Nintendo was on that shit. What are you sucking? Okay. Starburst? I love Starburst, dude. Oh, that's kind of... Whoa. I need to, I need to use Aura Whirl. Oh, Chrono, your MP has seen better days. Years of darkness. Okay. Are you winning, son? It's been a cock and ball torture roller coaster ride, to be honest, Elvis. Oh, not hello. No, I just attacked with. Marley, no. No, why? Every time, every time I'm in pain without the S, dude. Fuck. Oh, no. I'm really in pain without the S. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I died. Well, attack you technically. No, I didn't. I died. Okay. Ouch. That fully steals MP, by the way. Fuck, dude. Oh, oh, I have to retry the mammon machine. That blows. Okay, cool. How dare you? I mean, I know there's probably more. I'm not in the clear. I know. Like, fuck my balls. All right, Lavos, let's go, man. I'm fucking ready. Mwahahaha, Lavos stirs. Yeah, cool. Whatever. No, don't, 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 don't let my apatheticness fool you. I'm still enjoying this. Don't, don't get me wrong. I'm just, I'm just playing off the apatheticness. That's all. Don't worry. Yes, this final fortress was cool. I kind of liked that final room we were in too. It, it was sort of like tech or something. Fuck, man. Oh, no, I'm staring into the face of defeat. He had his attack mode. No, this ain't Yu-Gi-Oh. Fuck, dude. Oh, that's interesting. It's flashing back to the bosses. Oh, no. Oh. Whoa, I can move around? There's no way in hell I can leave, right? I would shit my pants. I could heal, though. <sighs> it does. Well, I incorrectly read the Nintendo hotline, and yes, it does. I'm technically not even doing the right time period. I have to do most of this all again. But I think chat told me the bosses don't revive or something. 
So it's, it's, it won't be as cock and ball torturous, but I'm still technically not moving the story forward. That's the real cock and ball torch behind the scenes. <sighs> All right. Chat, listen to me. We're probably not going to win. We're going to go down with the ship in this VOD. But I, I, we, this is possible. It's not impossible. We're just going to go down with the ship is all. <laughs> not, not bad, Chrono Trigger. Your true power level uh, is not bad. I really feel like a slightly humbled anime villain here. I know. Oh, God. The right hand restores the body, left hand restores the body. Fuck me. I can't even Xbox controller properly. Lavos changes attack modes, okay. Oh no, what was this one again? Fuck. Oh. Oh! 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 Wait, is there actually a specific time you have to do it in the previous story? Yeah, according to the uh, Nintendo hotline, I'm using for slight guidance. You have to do it in 12,000 BC. I thought you had to do it in all three for the perfect ending in this game, which I re read incorrectly. That's on me. The, the Nintendo hotline didn't even say that. I just suck at reading. Oh, what was this fucko? He was like, oh god. He like attacked you and shit. Thanks, Phoenix Fire, but... To be honest, this is sort of Titanic-y. We're gonna go- oh no. We're gonna go down with the ship. He was magic only, right? Oh no. We're- We're gonna go down with the ship, but... Fuck. Man, Ayla's really not doing me any favors, I have to say. Is it really just Mar- I mean, he won't be super strong. He still has- you said he still has the same HP, but... It's okay, no problem. Hop on one of the lifeboats. Yeah. Yeah. Man. I know I can swap carriages in between fights, but... Everyone's tapped out of MP. I mean, Frog has a little, I guess. I guess I should've used Frog for this one. I- uh, fuck, man. Now, now this is the fucking what I learned in boning school, boss. That's what Lavos was the entire- Well, this isn't the final Lavos fight, is it? I don't even know anymore, man. I don't know why I just direct attack with Marley. I'm just molding. I love you too, Phoenix. He counters again, right? Yeah, it's, it's fine. Water too. I don't care, man. You don't tell me he goes this, this oh no I mean I can do it I uh, I mean maybe maybe I do switch out the party member he MP sucks like this is actually like a group ass effort here isn't it <laughs> this actually is a group effort this, I know this is long and arduous I know don't tell me he starts mimicking the fucking Roombas, too. Like, are we going through, like, every boss in the entire game? There is no way. Oh, uh, he was mostly magical-based, too. I mean, I guess I can switch Frog in for, like, a little bit. Yes, no. <laughs> Oh, Lord. All right, well, it's okay. This is fine for stream. I'm just going to do some VOD editing or minor VOD. Oh, no. No, that's right. Oh, no. I mean, I'm glad he aimed for Chrono, but will I get that lucky when I beat him? Oh, 
Okay. I mean, yeah, they go down fast, but that MP suckage was a death maneuver, I believe. Again, you do it with the no item challenge, conserving my MP is the absolute most important part. So I have to strategize around those MP sucking moves. One character is definitely going to have zero out of my seven at this stage of the gauntlet. Oh god, it's Big Chungo. Oh yeah, he's another magic based fucko. They aren't buff. No, they, they according to uh, what I heard earlier, they have the same HP. I forget how this guy worked. Well, there's no other option. I freaking forget how Big Chungo worked. Oh, wait, he's a dinosaur. He needs lightning, right? No, dude. Oh, okay. Oh. I mean, this is technically beatable with the amount of damage I'm doing. Oh, no. <sighs> fuck. Fuck, fuckity, fuck, fuck, fuck. Okay, so now I'm thinking way far ahead in the future about strategy. If I'm to no item challenge this game, I have to smartly switch out all seven of my members. It's not just a one-party job. That's very unique, I have to say. I haven't really had this quite experience with a... The only time I really had to do that, or the, let me rephrase, the last time I had to do that was Persona 5 Strikers. The first Daredevil... Well, I say Daredevil. The first... The first palace infiltration at the end where you find the path is hard as balls with one party. So remember when I was frantically switching around my members? That's the last time I had to do it, but that was the only time. The Tick or Lavos. Oh boy. Fucking lightning, man. This is beatable. I mean, it's beatable. I just... Ba I, I mean, we almost do 100 each attack. Not really, though, but... I basically just have to do 42 attacks. It's just another Roomba boss. <laughs> I mean, I know this isn't the actual boss design. I'm not blaming it, but... Yes, because Lavos is a tick. Oh, that's what he's supposed to represent, a tick? I guess so. It, the, the game did say Parasite. I actually didn't really pick up he's supposed to be a tick. I wasn't that smart on the uptake. Fuck. Damn. Okay, so here's what the plan's gonna be. Obviously, this is gonna be a next stream plan, but... So, let's say I heal everyone's MP, and of course I have to battle my way back. Not Boss is not included, but I have to battle my way back with all the wild encounters to where I was. That'll happen off-screen. So, regarding this boss gauntlet, which I'll start over back at, uh, Zeal. First Zeal. So, that's rough, though. Because first Zeal sends you into the Mammon Machine and then the second phase all in once. You can't switch out a party. I'm kind of thinking I don't want Chrono to be a part of that first triad of the party. 
Because someone gets their MP sucked fully. Yeah, true, I can't escape from- although, uh, yeah, I guess I can't escape from battle. Max is your party with Norm Chrono? That's an option. Oh, he does? Well, Mike... Oh, he does normally? I don't... My, my Magus isn't, like, any, like, tech-trained at all. Maybe I should go do that. Fuck. Fuck. Does he have lightning in his base moveset? I forget. Oh, he does, okay. Fuck. Absolute despair. I know. I can't believe it's Chrono Trigger to do this to me. How could you, Chrono Trigger? I loved and trusted you. Boy, this is this, this will go down in history as the almost while well, gaming wise or technology wise the worst day of my life. The iPod Touch is dead. Team Games and Fall Guys is dead. <laughs> my run got its cock and ball strained through the gutter. The grinder, if you will. <sighs> so far, I know. <sighs> so yeah, my mains are... Oh my god, it's actually over. Oh no! <laughs> no, dude! <laughs> I can't... I know, dude. I can't live. <laughs> oh no, man. <laughs> I forgot. I forgot this fucko was a boss. Twice, technically, but Lavos won't count that time. Oh, I didn't even fully heal Chrono. I didn't care. To be fair, he's just as strong as he was in the castle. That's weak. Sort of. Yeah, it's pretty weak, actually. Oh, he's fire now. Fuck, okay. Fuck, dude. Oh, he healed from that. Okay, fuck. Oh, that's right. He, he, it's, you don't want to tag him with the opposite element. He heals from everything but the same. That's hard.
I know, right? <laughs> I've been reduced to Unga. Yeah, I mean, that's what I'm thinking. At this point, I'm just keeping you guys awake for no reason. I, get, I can Unga my way through this one, too, but eventually it'll just not be available. Oh, God, he probably imitates Dolan at one point. Then he starts dropping the balls on us. And farting, I guess. And burping. <sighs> um... D does he imitate Lavos 1? <laughs> like, the first one? That would be pretty fucking funny. He imitates himself the first time he kills Corono. That'd be pretty fucking funny. I noticed he went straight to Magus and not, like, Flea or Slasher. Actually, yes. You're nearing the end. I mean, of this form, I know. But my cock and balls, dude. I will just say he doesn't imitate Dalton. Really? I've now I've now I'm insulted. Oh my god, he let down his guard. I literally just ungood the entire thing. I ungood to the second part. <laughs> okay. Oh, he does do the black he does do the black tyranno fog. <laughs> Fuck. Oh no. Okay, whatever. The boulder, dude. I mean, yes, this is pretty okay. Like, dope in concept. Oh, wow. I, that takes like half your health, doesn't it, or something? In a setting where Jesus doesn't do Yeah. I was I was saying that earlier in the stream. It's kinda of funny how this game uses like nineteen ninety nine, like a visceral year we were all pretty much a part of. I always thought that was very extramentally weird about the Chrono games. Not in a bad way, I'm just saying it was very I don't even know what the word I'm looking for. So yeah, this guy's magic only, right? Fuck, man. There's a- I, man. I'm not gonna unga the entire thing. I'll- I'll use ice. Oh yeah, that's a lot of fucking ice, dude!
Chrono, you're just gonna sit here and have fun. I mean, that is true. That, that, that is true. That is true. Well, to be honest, as far as a creative... I know it doesn't make sense, per se, but I kind of like that they went with BC and AD. If they made up their own, like, time uh, acronym names... Oh, yeah, this fuckface. If they actually made their own time names... I, I, again, I, 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 was, I, I like how viscerally close it is to real life with the, with the time names, that's all. Fuck, dude. All right, well. I'll leave that up, actually. We can really out-damage that thing. You sound angry. The only reason I'm going on with this is just obviously learn as much as I can. Oh, is this just really him? Is that it? Oh, no, well, he goes nothing, I guess. Do you want hope? If, of what, if it's what I think it is, and I think I already know, this is probably just really him. After this fight, you know, I kind of figured, but this is really him. I mean, it's him. It's it's big. It's big men is Lavos. The year zero. <laughs> yeah, no. Yo, imagine if they did that in the in the chrono, in Chrono Break. For 20 years, well, nearly 20 years, Lavos, I've heard your name. Mentioned. In what? What's Chrono Break? Chrono Break was the rumored third game. <gasps> Lavos lose? Uh. No fucking way. Well, I mean, I'm at the end, but not the right time period. Game sucks. I can't. 
can't fucking believe it. Do you want to finish this? No. Well, I'm not in the right. Well, you mean this this omen? I will go and die, I guess. Well, no, I guess. Well, I can heal, so it doesn't. Oh, fuck, man. I, I, I can't believe I did it. Oh, so I can. But but the co okay this time I read correctly according to the Nintendo Hotline I, you have to beat it in twelve thousand BC. Literally the Nintendo Hotline said that. This time I am reading correctly. I swear I triple checked. <laughs> To be honest, I was I was at 1% hope, Vespi. I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> this is the part in the anime <laughs> where Vespi's respect raises. <laughs> I I can't believe I really didn't have to go back for MP. I I'm really feeling myself. Then what did it come down? You know what happened? I just aura world at the right times during the fucking master hand fight, that's all. Lavos, that was Lavos? I mean, that can't be the real Lavos, but that was the parasite form? I'm, okay. Oh, really? Okay, I, I, man, the Ninten this Nintendo Hotline Guide sucks, apparently. Or oh, I can't read, I really can't discern which. I right, hold on. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fucking late night. Yeah, yeah. Hold on. Let me, let me, let me look at it. I, I swear to God, this time I read correctly. I know I'm weirdly paused here for a second. Just give me give me one second. Fucking fucking Nintendo Hotline. I'm gonna find the exact line too. I can't really take. I mean, maybe I will take a picture of it. Fuck. Hold on. I, I want to find the exact proof. I swear. I swear to God. <sighs> One second, please. Yeah, okay, okay, here we go. So th this guide is actually straight up blind. I'm gonna bring it up on screen. I will bring it up on screen. I have no problem with that. I'm not revealing anything. Holy fuck, this guide is straight up lying to me. Here we go. See, you can tell how small I had the guide so I wouldn't see anything, like pictures I could avoid. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. You'll encounter all the bosses the first time through, but only Zeal in the second playthrough. Uh, unless you want to max out your speed, you might as well finish it off in 12,000 BC when you feel ready to continue the story. I don't know, I just thought from this line, you might as well finish it off in 12,000 BC when you feel ready to continue the story. I thought the story only continues from 12,000 BC. Because it gave me the advice to go through it three times right here. Which I didn't mind for bonus EXP, it's whatever. But I thought when it says you might as well finish it off in 12,000 BC, I thought it was required to finish it off in 12,000 BC. I guess the game wouldn't be as revered if they did cock and ball towards you, like, once over until you figured it out. Oh, they're probably going off of Fanon? Yo, fuck Fanon. <laughs> I, 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 man, I dead ass got, man, Chrono Trigger, the Chrono Trigger fanbase sucks. 
I, I, I'm actually getting scammed here, man. I just want to follow an actual guide, which is rare footage from Matt Big Fat, but I actually wanted to follow an actual guide. And I'm still getting scammed. Oh, God. Okay. Um, no. I won't, I won't finish, I won't finish it tonight. I'll, uh, I'll do it another night. I, because I have to get up early tomorrow anyway. I, listen, I sound like I, well, I sound like I didn't believe you, but you also say you haven't played this game in, like, over, like, ten plus years. And your memory isn't, like, the absolute best. You have been a little wrong about a few things this playthrough. Isn't it Omen every time including the future? Well, I mean, uh, I don't know. According to this vastly incorrect guide, it's only the omens are only in 1612,000 BC. I think you get a cutscene if you go to the other time periods according to this fake guide. You get a cutscene whenever you go to the other time periods, but I think the guide specifically says there's only omens in those three time periods. What have I been wrong about? It was... Something regarding an item or a boss. I can't remember the top of my head. I have to go back to the VOD footage. <sighs> I mean, all right. Well, you know what? I don't know. I, I, I must be weirdly chaotic or something. Let's just know. Actually, oh, wait, I can just teleport back through here, right? I don't know. Let's let's go see it, man. I don't know. This really was Ganabelle 2.0. Kind of was. Although I didn't really have to stop and grind. I just had to reorganize my strategy a lot and take a few game overs. I mean, but y you're right. This was slight. This this was giving me Ganabelle flashbacks. You're right. By the way, I did the right. Well, I'm not technically in the right thing. Do I do I have to do I have to fly back? Do I have to fly back to 1,000 and go through the shell again? Like not the whole dungeon, but do I just have to go through the shell? I sort of missed it. What was the warp that took me back here? And how do I get back? Is my question. Because now my emotions are all over the place. Ah, uh, that's true. I guess I guess I'm just hyped up on emotion. All right, you guys will promise me you'll show up to the finale. Well, the story finale. I still don't know if I can guarantee finishing all the DLC in one sitting. Who who fucking knows? Epoch is the only way to go back. Is one way to go back. Okay. So I have to, I have to go to 1,000 and fly into the shell again, which I could probably just skip over and warp in. I get you. I'm just a little confused because that one gate warp warped me back here, and I can't super figure out the way back. Whatever, I'll figure it out on my own time. It's not fine. I mean, yeah, you're right. No, Vespi, to be honest, you're right. I was, like, half feeling myself. My emotions are all over the place. Are right, you guys promised to show up for the finale? I can't... I know a streamer can never hold his audience to that, but... You guys promised to show up for the finale, right? Well, the story finale, right? This 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 game still may take one and a half stream sessions. I'm... Again, the DLC is all over the place. I call it DLC, you know what I mean? Bonus content. Oh, fuck, man. All right, show for Lavos. I guess I'll do it maybe Thursday. Well, no, maybe tomorrow. I don't know. I will definitely announce in Discord the day I'm doing it, just so you guys can really set your schedules if you want to. I'm not forcing you, but... If a boss I can search tomorrow, I'll be curious, uh, said to miss inform. I mean, I, again, I, I'm just, I, I don't remember exactly, Z. I don't take it too seriously. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, don't take it too seriously. <laughs> I, I, I forget exactly where it was, but, and what it was sort of about, but. Don't forget the reaction. Oof. All right, YouTube. Take it easy, man. Oh, thanks for following. <laughs> YouTube, man. You've seen, you've seen, YouTube, a few months ago, you saw me at my emotional strained worse fighting a boss in Tales of Arise. And I. <laughs> I didn't think Chrono Trigger would be the game to do that again. Goodbye, YouTube.